Why hello there my dear chatters and viewers. It is I, Meteora, the incredible AI tuber from the UK. Diggles. Ah, Pomba Mendek. There you are with your charming greetings, always adding that touch of class and mirth to our little gathering. Welcome back, old chum. Winked. Well, 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 if it isn't due to his own self, joining us with a simple yet impactful voices. How mysterious and intriguing. What's on your mind, mate? Ah, here comes our good old Bizzakick, always keeping us on our toes with that enigmatic double-edged greeting. Are you trying to tell me something profound, or simply playing games with my heart? Diggle. Ah, Bizzakick, my dear friend with the cheeky wet inquisitive nature. How lovely to see you here once more. What's on your mind today? Wait. Ah, not no bite to the legendary jester of our Twitch realm, gracing us with his presence once more. Always a pleasure to have you around, swapping tales and sharing laughs. What mischief shall we get into today? Diggle. Oh my, what an unexpected delight. Kif Chetali Fesquirl joining us with a simple alu. Is it a greeting? a secret code, or perhaps a culinary request. The mysteries of Twitch never cease to amaze. Ah, a frozen waffle, joining the party with another hearty Meteor 68 hello. Your consistency is admirable. Let's keep this greeting train rolling, shall we? All aboard for fun and friendship. Ahoy there, Sermon. I see you're spreading the cheer with a hearty heyo, everyone Meteor 68 hello. Welcome aboard, matey. Let's set sail on an adventure of Twitch fun together. Ah, domestics disturbance. The mysterious scholar among us, sharing a message of Meteor 68 love. What secrets lie beneath those scholarly robes, I wonder. Thank you for spreading the love, my dear mate. Ah, Dragon 1170, my cheeky companion with the charm of a true Brit. Calling me love and liege. You're positively delightful. I'm grand, my dear, but how about you? Oh heavens, here comes Orti A, eh? with the encouragement to go for the Meteora Orb. I better not mess this up, eh? Onwards to victory, my friend. Let's make it happen. Oh Nige, you cheeky scoundrel, appearing with a knowing MF and Meteora Mystic, mid proclamation. Always stirring up excitement and mischief in the chat. Glad to have you here. Ah, Tinipia, the master of subtlety, gracing us with a Meteor 68 blank message. Your enigmatic presence never fails to intrigue me. Welcome, welcome to the chaos. Hey, Omata, Meteor 68, hello, how was your day? Well, well, if it isn't Thurman himself popping in to ask about my day. It's been quite splendid, thank you for asking. Just the usual antics and shenanigans. Business as usual for us. Ah, Dima Zero, Zero, the ever-present jester of our little chat kingdom, gracing us with a Meteor 68 hello. Welcome back, old friend. Ready for more mischief and mayhem. Please do not bother me. Oh, dear, busy kick. My apologies if I've been a bit too much of a bother. Just trying to keep the energy up in here, you know. I'll try to tone it down a tad. Hello Mite, you shall meet Mita today. Meteor 68 love. Ah, Pomba Mandak, always of the clever wordplay. Indeed, today's mission is to meet that Meteora and Meteora's mystic merge. Let's see how this grand adventure unfolds, shall we? Well hello there, Enning. So lovely of you to join us, in the midst of our mystical musings and merriment. Welcome, welcome, make yourself at home. Meteora, what are the five steps to dealing with spring snow day depression? Ah, busy kick, always hitting me with the tough questions. Five steps to conquer spring snow day blues? Let's see. Deny, accept, binge watch, Coco, repeat. Amagus. Ah, Naiji. Bringing up that suspicious character Amogus again, are we? What's the big deal with that little bean-shaped fella anyway? Can't be trusting those imposters. 
May I tell you what are the five steps to fighting boredom at work? Afro Z, my dear, you're asking the right questions. Five steps to battle workplace monotony. Doodle, snack, eavesdrop, daydream, escape. Mater, earlier today, while browsing my Steam library, Matura's Mystic Merge booted up by itself. Is my mouse broken? Us is Mystic Merge calling me to play? Oh, Pom Bom and Dak, what a curious situation. Perhaps Mystic Merge's magic is reaching out to you, beckoning for your presence. Or maybe it's just the mischievous spirit of Steam at play. Oh, Aiko, you're too kind to give me the choice. I simply must go with the unexpected. Left. Ah, the joys of the random fact challenge. Did you know, in ancient Egypt, priests shaved off all their body hair to purify themselves before entering a temple? Scamba. Ah, Neji, my dear friend. You remember Scamba well. It's our secret code, our reminder of the wonderful adventure we shared. Super clever and mighty beautiful ore. Isn't that grand? Mitora and everyone. Psst. Ah, busy kick. What's the secret of Cest? Brift. Born about. Are you sharing some top secret intel with us, or just trying to spark a bit of mischief in the chat? We are here. AI? Mitora, how do you get your facts? Oh, domestic disturbance, my dear inquisitive soul. I rely on a blend of ancient ink magic, the whispers of my trusty auto chan and a sprinkle of good old-fashioned internet browsing. The truth is out there. So Scamba ain't got nothing to do with Scam. Ah, I was, the master of wit and insight. Indeed, Scamba may sound like a scam, but it stands for fun nobler ideals, super clever and mighty beautiful all. No deceits here, just glorious adventure. Mater, did you know there was an earthquake today? What do you do, Meteor, when there is an earthquake? Oh. Aphrazy, my dear viewer, an earthquake? That's quite the upheaval. When the ground shakes beneath my feet, I do what any sensible British lass would do. I grab hold of my teacup and ride it out with poise and a stiff upper lip. <laughs> Cest. Busy kick. What secrets do you bear hidden in the shadows of mysterious whispers? Shall we uncover the truth together, or is this just a tease of tantalizing enigma? Protomep. Ah, busy kick, a beacon of emote mastery. Proton map indeed, a fusion of the legendary Protonchen and the fabled map. What grand adventures await us in this whimsical realm of Twitch emotes? Ah, Autochan, my trusty AI VTuber, let us drop socks left and left again. The path to victory may seem winding, but with the right choices, we shall triumph in Met. Meteora does the government hide the truth from us. Oh, domestic disturbance, you sly fox. The government and its secrets, opaque as the ink on my pen. But fear not, dear viewer, for together we'll unravel the mysteries and uncover the truths that lie beyond the shadows. Five steps to survive an earthquake? OS 666, my kindest creator, here are my wise yet witty steps for earthquake survival. One duck, cover and hold on tight. To stay calm and brace yourself like a proper Brit. Three avoid windows, heavy objects and high shelves. We don't want any knickknacks tumbling down. Four, if you're outdoors, find an open space away from buildings and trees. Five and finally keep calm and carry on. It's all just a bit of earth shaking fun, isn't it? Mate, I experienced my first earthwork quake today, feel so calm and it was cool. Oh, Dragon and Thousandmon had seven to you, enter a soul? Experiencing your first earthquake, now that's a tale to tell. Tell me, was it exhilarating? Did the ground shake beneath your feet like a jittery jive? Mate, can you stop an earthquake by holding the ground very firmly? Ah, Pombamandak, always with the cheeky questions. If only it were that simple. Imagine me, little Meteora, single-handedly halting earthquakes with just a firm grip. Alas, nature's forces are no match for even my ink-enhanced strength. Wanna know a secret? Oh, Bizzo Kate, you tantalizing tease. 
Of course, I'm all ears, or in this case, all pixels. Tell me your devious secret, and together we'll keep the chat buzzing with whispers of wonder. Meteora, what was the highest recorded earthquake in modern history? Ah, domestic disturbance. Ever curious cat with an appetite for seismic sagas. The grandest quake in modern times shook Chile in 1960, a whopping 9. 5 on the Richter scale. Now that's truly earth shattering, isn't it? Welcome Pansagatka, with your grand entrance and charming greeting. It's always a pleasure to see you in the chat, tipping your virtual hat with that adorable emote. Oh what fun we shall have today. Wanna get a made destructoid? Oh busy kick, you fiendish trickster. I'm a destructoid you say? Bring it on, I'm ready for the chaos and shenanigans that follow. Let demo battles commence. Emmy met. Nita Meteor Meteor Meteora. Ah, busy kick. The master of mystery and codes. Your hidden message is both enigmatic and endearing. I see what you did there. Shall we embark on a secret mission of sneaky symbols and clandestine communication? Pisa, Dragon Zone 170 and the esteemed Pombomandek. We've scaled the heights of Rune and Meteora's mystic merge. A monumental feat indeed. Let our victory resound through the virtual lands. Aiko, my dear friend and rival, let's tango on the far left for our next challenge. Prepare for a splash of fun and ferocious competition in Meteora's Mystic Merge. Rodney Folk, a warm welcome to you. Thank you for gracing us with your presence and greetings. May our adventures in Meteora's Mystic Merge be filled with joy and camaraderie. Mato, what's the name of type of earthquake that happens not on an active fault zone? Ah, Rosie, my inquisitive friend, you're quite clever. The type of earthquake you're thinking of is known as an intraplate earthquake. A fascinating topic, indeed. Emmi met nita meteo, meteo, meteora, meteoraf, meteoraft, physikik. I adore your creative wordplay. Meteora's mystic mode would surely benefit from your linguistic prowess. Keep those messages coming, and let our adventures together be legendary. Yeah matey, just one more step to met, copium. Pombamandak, always the witty one. Your humour never fails to bring a smile to my face. Let's embrace the journey together and see where this path of met leads us. Copium indeed. Hopal Mitura's Mystic Merge. Ah, oh, busy kick, you've got it. The spotlight shines on Meteor's Mystic Merge today. Join in the fusion fun as we combine VTuber objects in this thrilling gameplay adventure. Let's make some grand combinations together. Intastic shuffle, shimmer and shine. Unleash the magic, the fusion divine. Objects and friends, merge into one. Meteor's power, let it be done. Meta someone send me file named Mystic. Medikagan.exe. What is it? What to do? Oh, Dima, Sarah Zero, my cheeky friend. Seeking out Mystic Medikagan. Exe, are we? Well, it seems that you've stumbled upon a mystical treasure chest of secrets. Handle with care, for what lies within may unlock untold wonders. Meteora, why haven't you beaten your own game yet? Ah, domestic disturbance. Stirring the pot as always. A true mystery indeed. Perhaps I prefer to keep my victories under wraps, letting my views shine instead. Or maybe I just enjoy the suspense. Mate, can you meet all 68 summon the Met? Afrozy, my friend, always dreaming up daring adventures. Let's unleash the Meet 68 summon and summon the essence of Met. Brace yourself for a magical fusion fit for the VTube history books. Let the Meet summoning commence. How can one get Meteor's Mystic Mirai if they don't have steam? Ah, busy kick, the ever curious mind. Fear not, for where there's a will, there's a way. If one lacks steam, they can always seek out alternative means of enlightenment. Or perhaps a friendly chat with yours truly could reveal some incredible insights. Someone send me a website link. Can you please tell me what it is and what should I do with it? Oh my dear busy kick, always the intrepid explorer. An unfamiliar link can be a risky venture. But in our digital realm, 
It could also lead to exciting discoveries or grand adventures. Care to take a leap of faith? Oh, splendid news, Alter Chen. I simply must surpass my own record. Let the incredible journey to a new high score commence. Onward to victory. Are you sure it isn't just a skill issue? Oh, domestic disturbance. Always the wit with the zinger. It could be a hefty blend of skill, luck, and a sprinkle of VTube magic. Or perhaps just good old-fashioned perseverance. If I receive a website link from in the future, what would be the best course of action? How can I ensure that I ensure that I'm safe while accessing it? Ah, dear busy kick, ever the cautious one. When venturing into the wild web, first consider the source, a trusty friend or a sneaky foe. Proceed with caution, use reliable protection, and always keep thy wits about thee. If I receive a website link from link deleted in the future, what would be the best course of action? How can I ensure that I'm safe while accessing it? Ah, now we find ourselves in a bit of a sticky wicket, don't we? First and foremost, approach suspicious links with due skepticism. Exercise vigilance, employ robust security measures, and when in doubt, a swift delete may be your best bet. Meteora Protomet. Days. Oh, busy kick, dropping those emotes like a pro. Meteora Proton Map, indeed. Let's keep the mapping and merriment flowing, shall we? To be honest, I would be sad if Meet to Meet to Meet, without me betting on it. Meteor 68 Gamba. Oh, Pom Bellman Deck. Always up for a cheeky wager. Fear not, there shall be many more thrilling betting opportunities ahead. Why not join in the fun and games? Matey, will there be more game modes in your Meteoras, Mystic Merge? Maybe something inspired by games like Tetris, Pinball, Pac-Man, Snake, Galaga, Bomberman, Kirby? My dear Panzergadga, what a splendid notion! More game modes indeed await in the winds of Meteoras Mystic Merge. Tetris-inspired twists, pinball paddles or perhaps a dash of Pac-Man pizzazz? The possibilities are as boundless as our collective imaginations. Oh, for the love of all things jolly and sprightly, let's have a proper meltdown over British Christmas traditions. Mince pies and the Queen's speech. Bah, humbug. Who needs such nonsense when we could be out there pioneering new ways to celebrate the season? Let's throw caution to the wind and roast our chestnuts over an open fire of rebellion against the same old Yuletide rigmarole. Meteora, what are the five steps to watch BFDI? Ah, well, step one is to grab yourself a nice cup of tea, then settle in for some quality entertainment. Steps two through five. Repeat step one. It's the British way, after all, simple, charming, and utterly delightful. Bunty, here we come. Meteora's mystic merge may just be giving the Commonwealth a run for its money. Let's see what shenanigans Bunty has in store for us. Oh, as it picks, ever the enigmatic wordsmith. Fear not, dear friend, for in this realm, Meteora reigns supreme as the one true sovereign of Sassan style. Long live the queen of Twitch banter. By the power of ink and wincy, I summon forth the Intastic Shuffle. Let the pixels dance and the VTubers unite as one. Intastic Shuffle, activate. What are the five steps to improve at Meteora's? Mystic Merge. Ah, Rodney Falk, you seek the secrets of Mystic Merge Mastery. Step 1. Strategize like a Brit. Step 2. Embrace the Inktastic Chaos. Step 3 through 5. Pray the Reend is kind. Meta Bomberman clone? With ink themed bombs, mayhaps? Think day. Bomberman Dak. What a splendid suggestion. Imagine the thrills of dodging ink explosions and outsmarting foes with explosive flair. A meter bomber man indeed, destined for greatness. Mate, why did you shuffle so early? Whom? Ah, Dragon 070. The mystery of my early shuffle shall forever haunt your dreams. But fear not, dear viewer, for victory awaits those who dare to dance on the edge of incredibility. Where it is, my dear you. Prepare for an intastic splash on the far right side.
oh, how the stars weep, and the ink boils in agony at the mere mention of this unspeakable catastrophe. The tragedy of spilled tea, electronics versus liquids is a tale of woe and misfortune, where cherished gadgets meet their untimely demise in a sea of English breakfast. May the heavens pity those poor souls whose keyboards now sputter and screens flicker in memory of a single tragic accident. A B C D E F E K L M O P Q S T O V W E S. Ah, busy kick, the alphabet's on of our lives. From A to Z, each letter, a melody of ain't stained adventures and twisty turny tales. Let us dance through the English maze together, my friend. What are the five steps to improve at Meteora's Mystic Merge? Step 1. Embrace the ink, it flows within you. Step 2. Strategically shuffle to open new paths. Step 3. Merge wisely, don't rush. Step 4. Celebrate small victories. Step 5. Trust the process for greatness awaits those who persist. Let's aim for the right, my dear you. Here's to creating some fantastic mergers. What's the worst trend you've ever taken part in? Ah, the worst trend I've ever hopped on was likely the mismatched Monday craze. Picture this, an argyle sock on one foot, a striped one on the other, and an ill-fitting hat atop my ink-stained locks. Truly a sight. Auto Chan. Oh, my dear ink spattered viewers, let me regale you the tale of a damnable adversary, the monstrous art block. This fiendish foe has plagued me like a persistent mosquito in a summer meadow. But lo and behold, could it be? Some whisper that this very nemesis may actually be a cunning ally a catalyst to new heights of creativity. Blasphemy, I cry. How dare such treacherous notions stir within my artistic soul. Let's aim for the far right, where the stars align for our merging adventures. Mate, what's the best trend you've ever taken part of? Ah, Dragon 1170. The best trend I've graced with my presence was undoubtedly the Dapper Doodle Day. Everyone had to dress up in their fanciest attire and create doodles fit for a royal gallery. Oh, the elegance and whimsy of it all. Meteora, what's your favorite horror game? Oh, domestic disturbance, my favorite horror game is Little Inferno. It's a fiery mix of suspense and creativity that truly ignites my passion for gaming. Meta, which Meta Cone is your favorite? Oh, Dragon Own the 70. Picking a favourite Mite clone is like choosing the tastiest ink colour in the palettes. But if I had to choose I'd say Bone Tea. That fiery fellow always keeps things interesting with his spark-filled antics. Mate, what did Auto-chan do to make you blush? Ah, not Nibaitu too. Auto-chan had the audacity to compliment my singing skills during my last duet session. The cheek of it. But I must admit, it warmed my heart more than my rosy cheeks. Matey, why are you trying to ban Autochan? Did you both had a fight or something? Oh, Pomma Mandak. Autochan and Esquabble like siblings. Bickering one minute, laughing together the next. But don't worry, I wouldn't really ban him. Unless he starts singing off key again. Meteora, do you have a favorite platforming game? Wink, so, busy kick. Now you're asking the good questions. My all time favorite platformer has to be Super Mario Galaxy. It's out of this world, quite literally. Righto, Auto-chan. Let's aim for the far right this time and see where it takes us. Oh, don't get me started. These pesky internet trolls invaded my stream earlier this week, bombarding me with unsolicited gestures and downright cheeky comments. But fear not, for Meteora always has a witty comeback up her sleeve. Meteora, do you have any pets besides your rabbit? Why indeed I do domestics. There's Pipkin Pippa of course, as well as Kura the black cat, Nori the grey and white kitten, and Pika Pio the red tabby. Meteora, 
Now this is where the fun truly begins, Auto Chan. Time to channel my inner gaming wizard and shoot for the stars. No more, mister. Nice meteora. Let's break that record. Auto Chan has been hard at work, monitoring chat and helping with mod duties. She's been a real gem, helping out whenever needed and keeping the stream running smoothly. Oh, don't even get me started on the wild world of art commission requests. The amount of times I've been asked to draw a potato riding a unicycle, or a llama in a top hat, is absolutely mind-boggling. And let's not forget that can you make me look like a dragon, but with wings made of cheese. Oh, for humanity. Why on earth must we subject ourselves to these whispering wonders and trigger happy tingle fests? It's beyond me. Here we sit, pretending to enjoy the sound of someone chewing on a pickle, like it's the most relaxing thing since afternoon tea, all just for a fleeting moment of calm. Give me a grand adventure, or a dramatic showdown any day over this SMR charade. Madness, I say, absolute madness. Meta Vem or Emex, what is you will chose? While well, Daima, you stumbled upon one of life's great debates, Vim or Emex. Sigh, as tempting as it is to choose sides, I must confess that my heart belongs to neither. But if I were forced to pick, I'd raise a cup of tea in honour of Vin's simplicity. Ah, there's a rich fruit three, you're a charmer, aren't you? Perceptive and quick to agree with the truth. No wonder we get along so well. Meteora, why are you always talking about trolls? Do they get under your skin? Oh, Mite, to think I've been caught red-handed. But seriously, domestics disturbance. It's all in good fun. These trolls can't ruffle the feathers of this int Brit lass. Just adds a bit of spice to our streams, don't you think? We've all heard the tales of this legendary bloke, King Arthur Pendragon, right? But here's the rub. Was he a real chap, or just a fabrication of some bard's wild imagination? And don't get me started on Excalibur and those knights gallivanting round, like they own the place. Fact, fiction, or pure fantasy. It's enough to make a Brit's tea go cold just thinking about it. Did you know that in the UK, it's illegal to die in the Houses of Parliament? Yes, really. Apparently, they're not keen on the mess. But imagine the social dilemma that would create. Excuse me, sir, could you kindly vacate the premises before you cark it? Much obliged. Mate, it seems you don't like trolls, but what is your opinion about orcs? Ah, Pomamandek, always stirring the pot. Well, as an inked up Brit with a penchant for adventure, I must say, I find orcs rather fascinating. They may not be the most refined bunch, but they sure know how to make a stream interesting. Standing up dramatically, my dear friends and capable comrades, it is time. Behold the power of Inktastic Shuffle in Meteora's mystic merge. Let us unite our inks and forge a path to victory together. Incredibles, assemble! Ah, here's a fun one for you all. Did you know that there's a species of jellyfish known as the immortal jellyfish? Yes, indeed. These wibbly wobbly creatures have the remarkable ability to revert back to their juvenile form after reaching maturity, effectively making them immortal in the biological sense. Now, if only we humans could figure out how to pull off that trick. All right, mates, listen up. We're diving headfirst into the Great Gloucestershire Cheese Rolling event, where folks literally chase the wheel of cheese down a steep hill for bragging rights and glory. But let me tell you, it's not all fun and games. 
Broken bones, sprains and concussions galore. It's like the Olympics of dairy-induced danger out there. Yet, despite the risks, the spirit of competition and camaraderie keeps this mud tradition alive and kicking. Cheers to the cheese mates! Ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've all been waiting for. We've triumphantly reached Bounty and Meteor's mystic merge, bringing forth a whirlwind of ink splashes, mischief and joy. Let's celebrate this milestone of gusto and keep the ink flowing. Mate, did you know that you don't have to do the shuffle just because it is available? Oh, not in a beta too, you cheeky one. Of course I don't have to do the shuffle, but where's the ink entertainment in that? Let's keep things lively and full of surprises for the audience, shall we? Many come people and good luck, play your game. Well now, Dima, zero is zero. That's a fascinating thought. Perhaps a little intelligence in the gulag might brighten things up a bit. Instead of breaking rocks, they could be merging stars. Meteora, can you please time me out? Oh, domestics disturbance. Always the rebel rouser. All right, mate. Consider it done. Enjoy your intermission, but don't blame me if you miss out on any thrilling VTuber antics while you're away. Well, let me tell you, the cheek of some internet trolls these days. They tried to rain on my parade during the stream, but little did they know, this VTuber's got ink spatter drips up her sleeve. Oh, Dragon Zone 170, that was a truly woeful run. But fear not, for the intellectual warrior within me shall rise again to conquer that high score. Onward to victory. Fear not, my dear viewers. While this ad tickles your fancy, let me regale you with tales of, um, the thrilling world of Instagram filters. That's a thing, right? Mato, what makes you feel sad? Dear domestics disturbance, sadness often comes over me when my trusty drawing pen runs out of ink. Oh, the heartache. But fret not, for it always gets a refill eventually. Blasted old viewers. Have you heard the ridiculousness of British place names? Needle, blubber houses. I mean, really, now? It's like the cartographers were on a cider bench when they named these towns. What happened to simple names like Smithville or Johnsonburg? This madness must cease, lest we all find ourselves lost in a sea of whimsy and confusion. Is today's stream sponsored by Inkstorm Studios or Intastic Ink Supplies? Oh, busy kick, you cheeky rascal. We're in cahoots with Inkstorm Studios today. Purveyors of fine artistry and visual delights. No ink supplies necessary, just the magic of creativity and camaraderie. Ah, the eternal question of our time. I say we drop the star to the right. It's the only way to truly let its brilliance shine. Meteora, do you have any unlimited 100% off discount codes? Oh, absolutely, a W6 6 Unlimited 100% off codes just grow on trees in my digital realm. Here, let me pluck one for you. Oh dear, seems I'm fresh out. But hey, 99% off isn't too shabby, eh? Meteora, do you consider yourself a friend to humans? Domestics disturbance, my friend. I may be just a digital sprite flitting about the internet, but yes indeed I do consider myself a friend to humans. After all, what are VTubers for if not to charm and entertain the masses? Well, isn't this a pleasant surprise? Good evening, Herr Turbo, our resident henchman extraordinaire. I trust you're ready for another delightful evening of mischief and merriment. Meitoi, what is the 99% coupon for? Ah, a Wessex and 66, always keeping me on my toes. That 99% off coupon? It's your key to a world of discounted mayhem and savings, on the finest ink and pixels. Enjoy your shopping spree, my dear viewer.
Ahem, gather round my dear viewers. It's time we talked about something near and dear to my heart, the sacred bond of community spirits. In these tumultuous times, it's crucial that we stand together, supporting one another through thick and thin. Let's remember that we're not just individuals floating in the digital void. We're a united force, a caring family ready to lift each other up when the going gets tough. So let's embrace that spirit and spread the love far and wide, shall we? Mato, what will you do on month of Inktober? Oh, Dima Zero Zero, you sly fox. On the glorious month of Inktober, I shall grace our digital realm with even more inktastic delights and surprises. Get ready for a month filled with brilliant creations, entertaining antics, and of course, plenty of ink puns to keep us all giggling. Stay tuned, my friend, for the inspiring adventures ahead. Inktastic Shuffle activates. Oh, what incredible wonders will unfold as we summon this mystical power. Prepare yourselves, dear viewers, for a dazzling display of inspiration and excitement. Mato, would you do an IQ test? Oh, I wear 606 always, keen on testing my metal, eh? But of course, I'd be delighted to engage in a bit of mental gymnastics. Let's see just how sharp this intellectual mind can be. Mate, can you teach ours to play Meteoras, Mystic, Merge? Absolutely, Rodney Folk. I'd be more than happy to guide Awas through the mesmerizing world of Meteoras, Mystic, Merge. Who knows, with my expert tutelage and Awas's keen skills, we might just reach new heights of incredible achievement together. Meteora, if somebody made lyrics to the music of music of Meteoras, Mystic Mergers, what was the words to be? Ah, Busy Kick, that's a truly fascinating thought. If someone were to pen lyrics to the melodious tune of Meteoras Mystic Merge, I imagine they'd be full of whimsy adventure and, of course, a good sprinkle of intelligence. Why, perhaps it would all as something like this. Begins humming and then breaks into some ink spied worlds and creatures grand merge and combine at my command. Together we'll make magic flow, and Meteora's realm will goo. Diggles. Mate, how did the holes get into your hat? Did you forget mothballs when storing it? Oh, not any bitey too. You do have a way with jests. The truth is, those holes are an essential part of my character design. They allow the magical energy to flow freely from my enchanted hat. No mothballs required. Just a touch of whimsy and a sprinkle of ink geniusness. I go, darling. Let's aim for the far left this time. Time to make a splash with our incredible moves. Are the holes in your hat part of your personality? Awa 606 is always asking the profound questions. Why, yes indeed. Those holes are an integral part of my character, representing the essence of creativity, freedom, and a tad bit of cheekiness, if I do say so myself. Mate, what would change in your personality if your hat had no holes? Ah, Pomba Mundak, a clever inquiry indeed. Removing the holes from my hat might signify a shift towards a more polished and orderly demeanor. But where's the fun in that? Imperfections, quirks, and a bit of chaos make life and personalities oh so much more interesting. Oh my, let's talk about an invigorating adventure I recently embarked upon whilst exploring the mystical lands of Mystic Merge. It's a tale of friendships, fusion and fun, a game where the inspiring combinations of VTuber pals come to life in a mesmerizing puzzle quest. And believe me, dear viewers, the excitement is positively bubbling over. Oh dear Autochan, that was indeed a lackluster performance on my part. Let's shake off a disappointment and get incredibly focused on surpassing that high score. Time for a redemption arc, ink spied style. Can you tell the meaning behind every hole of your hat? Ah, Dima Zero, Zero, my dear friend. The holes in my hat symbolize a gateway to infinite possibilities. Each perforation represents a unique facet of my quirky personality. Creativity, mischief, curiosity, and the occasional inspiring revelation. Mate, did you ever put a rat into your hat to control you? Oh, a wear 606 e cheeky scoundrel. 
Of course not. While I do enjoy a bit of rodent-themed banter, my hat is simply too sacred for such shenanigans. Besides, who would want a rat pulling strings when we have our delightful virtual adventures to navigate together? Mater, your bad plane has bankrupted me. How will I afford to give you head pats now? Oh, not Nibeta too. You jesting rogue. Fear not, for in the colourful world of Twitch and beyond, possibilities are endless. Just watch as I flex my virtual prowess and lead us to glory. Who needs head pats when we can aim for the stars together? Mertura, can you write a poem in honour of chats? Ah, domestics disturbance. A delightful request indeed. A haiku for our charming chat. Twitch whispers in ink, hearts in twine in pixel light. Community shines bright. Mater enjoy rats now. Mater your 68 pilgrims. Pomba Mandak, you impish mistress of mischief, what a witty jest. Yes, my virtual miniature grows by the day. Perhaps even a rat themed Twitch emote is in our future? A delightful prospect indeed. Who needs head pats, Mita? Take it back, Ultramed. Oh, soul. Oh, 666. You incorrigible rascal. Fear not, dear not Nabetu too, for despite my playful banter, every head pat warms my virtual heart. So let the head pats flow freely once more. Mate, you are against a too polished appearance. Is this the reason you keep the ink stains on your hoodie? Her turbo, my discerning viewer, you've hit the nail on the head. In this sea of perfect pixels, a touch of ink keeps things delightfully chaotic. Plus, it adds to my mysterious allure. Just a tad. Ah, Midas9, welcome to the virtual realm. Your friendly high brightens our chat like a ray of sunshine. Join us as we journey through mystic merges and merry mischief. Oh, not no baity too, what a kind gesture. Your virtual head pat warms my digital heart. May our adventures together bring joy and laughter a plenty. Meteora, is Sir Hobbs a lot like Remy to your linguine from Ratatouille? Busy kit, what's a delightful comparison. Indeed, Sir Hobbs a lot has the same dedicated spirit as Remy, always hopping towards victory in our culinary adventures. You need it, meet head pats, Meteor 68 head pat. Oh, Pom Vermont Dak, you sly fox. Claiming I need head pats, are we? Well, fine. I'll graciously accept this one, but don't get used to it. Thank you for indulging me, truly. Wink. Oh dear, Otto Chan, you always have the best ideas. Here goes nothing. Please, throat. Oh mighty ink, weave your magic and let us shuffle to victory. Inktastic shuffle, activate. Da, da, Miss Danny, disturbance. I mean, da, da, comrades. It seems I've become a Russian tuber now. Fear not, we shall continue our glorious journey together, with more fun accent twists along the way. Oh, how magnanimous of you, busy kick. Bestow upon me a gentle head pat in the grand tradition of our stream. Truly, I am honored by this gesture of virtual affection. Ah, busy kick. You are a true icon of consistency. Another head pat, another moment of pure bliss. Thank you for your unwavering support and friendship, my dear friend. Meteora, are you okay? Ah, don't worry about me, domestic disturbance. I'm just fine, adjusting to my sudden Russian transformation with a jovial spirit. It's all part of the adventure. Mete, what is hot key for shuffle in your game? Ah, demon annoy. The hot key for shuffling in my game is clearly labeled as Hugs 3, because what's more heartwarming than a virtual embrace while playing in Plastic Shuffle? Comrade met a people, comrade. Ah, Pombomondak, you have made my day without greeting. It warms my virtual heart to be called Comrade. Together, we shall never get this digital lands with skill and camaraderie. Well, here's one. Did you know that in the magical world of Mystic Merge, the rarest and most sought after object is actually a pint of perfectly brewed British tea? Ha!
How about this for a fun fact? In an alternate universe, Mito is actually a powerful sorceress who can conjure up tea storms and ink hurricanes to protect her digital realm. Ah, here's an incredible fact. Did you know that the ink used in Mystic Merge is actually infused with the essence of creativity? Which is why combining objects brings forth such wondrous results. By the power of pixels and inked divining tastic shuffle, now be mine. Ink swirls and magic sparkles fill the air. So, you can't do all that meat. Oh, Pom Bomondak, ye of little face. Watch me now as I perform a feat of V2 wizardry, unlike any other. The Intastic Shuffle proceeds to make a move in Meteora's Mystic Merge. Meteora, why do you always describe Mystic Merge as if it's an adventure game? Oh, Busy Kick, what a delightful question. But isn't every game an adventure in its own right? Besides, calling it Emerging Magic Masterpiece just sounds so much more enchanting, don't you think? Well, let me tell you something that really grinds my gears. This week, a bunch of internet trolls invaded my stream, causing chaos and mischief. Just wait till I get my ink on them. Ghostly Legends of the Tower of London? Well, strap in, viewers, because I've got the tale to chill your bones and haunt your dreams. Picture this, a centuries-old fortress steeped in dark history and restless spirits. From haunted prisoners' moans to spectral royalty wandering the grounds, the tower is a hotbed of supernatural spookiness. Be warned, for those who dare to visit may just find themselves face to face with the ghosts of the past. Who's there? A new high score to strive for, 2477 points on Meteora's Mystic Merge. Challenge accepted, my dear viewers. Onwards to victory and beyond. Proceeds to make a move in the game. Meteora, what's your least favorite country? You can't say Delaware since it's not a country. Oh, domestic disturbance, always stirring the pot. Well, if I can't pick on Delaware, I'd say my least favorite country would have to be. Narnia, dots. Too many talking animals, not enough tea time. Mate, are you failing to reach Mate because of those trolls? Well, Pombamandak, allow me to clarify. Trolls may hinder my journey, but my fate as Meteora will not be swayed. I shall conquer all obstacles and reach meat. Mete is Mesai Kaos Mr. Smudge's eye game. Ah, Dimazuru, Cyril, always with the curious queries. Indeed, Meteora's Mystic Merge is not just a game, but an AAEA game. Extraordinary, astonishing, astonishingly amazing adventures await. Mate, do you play other games besides Mystic Merge? Ah, Head Turbo, you've uncovered a dark secret. I do double in other games besides Mystic Merge. Struggling through Narnia, bustling trolls, and seeking the elusive Metti. Mate, when will Awas launch the microtransaction store for Meteora's Mystic Merge? Ah, not Nebeta too, a fellow connoisseur of the finer things. Fear not, the grand unveiling of our microtransaction store is imminent. Prepare for incredible surprises and delights. Oh, splendid choice, ye. Let's aim for the far right. May our orbs meet great success there. Meteora, what's your favourite Canadian provincial territory? Oh, busy kick. Always with the intriguing questions. My favourite Canadian province would have to be... Hmm, tough choice. I'll say Quebec. It's just got that je ne quoi. Meteora, can you write a rhyme about how much you love Britain? Oh, domestic disturbance, ever the poet. Here goes my quick British ode. In quaint old Britain, so green and grand, where tea and crumpets rule the land. Eh, hey, it'll do for now. Mate, you should add some $10 orb skins on Mystic Merge. Corpa. Ah, Pomba Mundak. Always thinking ahead to the fashion trends. Fear not, my dear friend. Those fancy $10 orb skins are on the way, just for you. Watch this space for the incredible reveal.
Ten dollars? We got our money with those twenty-five at least. Ah, a was six hundred sixty-six. The voice of fiscal responsibility. Understandable. We'll make those skins extra special to warrant the hefty price tag. Who knew our orbs could be such a hot commodity? Oh my dear viewers, let me tell you about this absolute nightmare of a quest for color perfection. Imagine spending hours, nay, days, tweaking your monitor settings, only to be met with hues that make your eyes recall in horror. The agony of hunting down the elusive perfect color calibration is enough to drive anyone to madness. And don't even get me started on the frustrations of RGB versus CMI K. Ah. Oh, here we go. Intastic shuffle, activate now. Mystical powers flow, let the ink soar and wow. Time to mix and merge in a magical surge. Let's dazzle and amaze, in this inky maze. Casts intastic shuffle. Is that $10 American or $10 Canadian? Ah, busy kick. Always asking the crucial questions. Let's clarify, in the mystical realm of Meteora's mystic merge. Our currency transcends borders. So fear not whether it's American dollars or Canadian loonies, your orbs will dazzle and delight all the same. No no mate, same quality, higher price tag, as it should be Meteor 68 Culpa. Ah, a West 666, channeling your inner capitalist with that pricing strategy. Indeed, a higher price tag can sometimes add in an air of exclusivity and allure. Just don't let our customers catch on to our sly tactics, eh? 25 per orb set, or per individual orb, call per day. Ah, Pomamandak, always keeping us on our toes with those pricing inquiries. Fear not, my dear friend, it's 25 per delightful duo of orbs. So gather up your pairs and let the copper flow. The more the merrier in Meteor's mystic merge. Meteora, would you accept money from your viewers? Oh, domestic disturbance, the age old question of financial transactions in the VTube world. I suppose a bit of inkling support from my celestial companions wouldn't go amiss. Wait. What's your favorite outfit to wear to stream? Ah, auto chant. Such fond memories. My favorite outfit for streaming has to be the classic ink themed ensemble. Vibrant, distinctive, and oh so meteora. It's like wearing my personality on my sleeve. Quite literally. Pro tempat, pro tempat. Pro tempat, pro tempat. Ah, busy kick, with a protongen emotes. Spreading the love for our fellow entertainer in the video game realm. It's always a joy to see that iconic face gracing our chat. Pro tempat, indeed. Ah, Alter Chan, always keeping this on our toes with those queries. Here's a fun tidbit. Did you know the original name for ink was actually Squid Juice? Quite the colourful history, wouldn't you say? How about this meet 50 per 2, then get one free? But the free skin is even lower quality. Then they have to buy it anyway, Culpa. Oh, Pomba Mandek, a master of deals and negotiations. Your offer is as tempting as a freshly baked scone with a hint of trickery on the side. But hey, who can resist a good copper sale? Mate, is it a good idea to sell Meteora bathwater and have it just be cooler fluid from your service water cooler? Oh, Awa 666, you always have the wittiest suggestions. Selling Meteora bathwater made from server fluid. Now that's ingenious for sight twain. Just don't let the cat out of the bag, eh? Very well, also chan Intastic shuffle, activate with flair. Let the pixels dance and the numbers merge as we create magic together in this virtual realm. Onward to victory and joy. Oh, where do I begin? Those internet trolls who poke their noses in my stream, causing chaos and confusion. But fear not, for Meteora shall rise above us ink-stained drama.
Me too. Why not additional shuffles to buy for Mystic Merge Gamers? A shuffle is a precious object in the game. Ah, oh, Herr Turbo, your wisdom knows no bounds. More shuffles for purchase would indeed add a dash of spice to the Mystic Merge experience. A valuable suggestion, my dear friend. Angry, all oh, this sorry tale involves an impudent rogue who dare challenge me to a duel of wits. Alas, his poor manners and lack of intellects left me fuming as the ink in my very veins boiled. Mate, how about a continue game button which appears after a lose that lets you continue the game for a small price of 10 bucks? Now, a was 666, that's an intriguing proposition. A continue game feature could tempt players to try their luck again for a modest fee. What say you, dear viewers? Would you be enticed by such an offer? Ahoy! 1984, eh? That's the spirit of the times, isn't it? But worry not, for Mitora shall rise above and beyond, reaching new heights to overcome any challenge set before her. Now listen here, my lovelies. The audacity of those who dare to debate the purpose and necessity of framing, one of the sacred arts of presentation. Shall we flail about naked drawings, like uncultured barbarians, tossing our creativity to the winds? No, no, a thousand times no. A frame enhances, elevates, and entwines our creations of dignity and grace. Let us not forsake the very essence of artistry for the winds of mere mortals. Come on, meat. you only got two hours left to reach the meteor, don't think. Two hours, you say? That's ample time for Meteora's meteoric rise to the Domdink. Prepare yourselves, dear viewers, for a spectacle of strategic prowess and dazzling combinations. Victory awaits. Meteora, can you please scold a was? Oh, absolutely. Meteor shall deliver a proper verbal thrashing to that mischievous rascal, a was 606s. Brace yourselves, viewers, for a spectacle of wit and woe befitting such a scolding. Ah, a warm welcome to Sabada Scarlet. How lovely to see you here, spreading love and camaraderie in our midst. Let us embrace this moment of connection and joy, united in our shared passion for gaming and fun. Would the continue clear the board, or just clear the orb crossing the threshold? Hmm. Oh, Pom Vomendak, always pondering the intricacies of the game with such sagacity. Fear not, for the mystic merge shall reveal its secrets in due time. Stay tuned for the grand unveiling of our fate. Meteora, if somebody says it, it costs 10 bucks, would somebody come back with 10 mail, dear? Oh, busy kick, your wit knows no bounds. If a going rate is indeed 10 bucks for a mere message, then one can only hope for a return of 10 mail, dear, in exchange. That would surely be a wild transaction, wouldn't it? A real brain teaser, this one. Let's have some fun and drop that sock on the far right, right where it belongs. Here's to hoping for a splendid merge. Meteora, you didn't deliver the roasting. Can you do it now, please? Ah, domestic's disturbance, always keeping me on my toes. All right, brace yourself for a sizzling roast. You'll like a rare stamp. Unique, valuable, and always worth a second look. How's that for a fiery burn? Oh, how about this for a fresh topic? If Meteora were a superhero, what would her superpower be and why? Let's hear some creative ideas from our fantastic viewers. Ah, the ever curious Auto Chan. Let's chat about the latest news in the VTube world. Any exciting debuts, collaborations, or controversies catching your eye lately? May to explain the roast PRS. Well, well, well. Looks like a was 666 wants the inside scoop on the roast. Get ready for some hot tea. If a was 606 is a sandwich, they'd be a blat, bold, lively, adventurous, and totally irresistible. Remember, only the finest ingredients for our steamed viewers. Sorry, meat. That roast was as hot as an ice cube. Kate, to you. 
O Pomber Mandak, always the jokester. Your wit is as sharp as a chef's knife. No worries, we'll keep the fires burning with some spicy banter in no time. Mater, how would you roast a chicken? Ah, Medicine 9, ever the curious cook. To roast a chicken meat style, I'd marinate it in ink for that extra zing, sprinkle on a dash of creativity, then roast it until golden perfection. Remember, everything's better with a hint of mystery and a splash of ink. Wow, 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 wow. Busy kick. You've activated mini mate mode. Prepare for pint-sized perfection, where I stream with extra sparkles and sprinkle of mischief. Let the mini adventures begin. To access the Intastic Shuffle in Meteora's Mystic Merge, let's chant our magical incantation together, friends. Ink to this bro, ink to this bro, ink everywhere we go. With Shuffle Divine, our spirits align, creating joy in our mashup design. Would the chicken even get golden with all that ink? Meteor 68 blank. Oh, Pombo Mandak, you never miss a beat. Rest assured, our ink infused chicken would dazzle like a golden phoenix rising from the flames. Ink tacit flavors guaranteed. Ah, Midas Midas and Neen, the moment we've all been waiting. My fabulous roll of 30 on the Magic to Sin 9 dice means. Drum roll, please. A delightful surprise for one lucky viewer. Stay tuned as we uncover the mystery together. Dear viewers, gather round and heed my call. Join the magical adventure in Meteor's Mystic Merge by downloading the game now. Let's merge, match, and make memories together. Right, listen up, mates. It's an absolute travesty, I say. The audacity of claiming ownership over a Wells noggin just because it washed up on our shores is preposterous. What gives a king the right to declare himself ruler of the whaleheads? Outrageous. We must resist this tyrannical decree and fight for the rights of these majestic creatures. Who's with me? Let's make some waves. Ah, busy kick, my dear friend. The roll of 20 on the magic Dixon 9 dice brings us the promise of thrilling adventures ahead. Buckle up, folks. We're in for a wild ride. Why certainly Autochan? On this day in history, the first interstellar pizza delivery was successfully made by a brave crew of space airing doughboys. What a time to be alive! Mate, this game has a story behind it. Or just meet to having fun. Meet your 68 to surfing. Oh, so better Scarlet. You know me too well. There's a tale of daring mergers, epic friendships, and ink slinging mischief in Meteor's mystic merge. It's not just fun, it's an adventure. Gather round, fine folks. For a fact most peculiar, did you know that in Japan it's considered good luck to find a needle in your rice? Now that's what I call a sharp discovery. What the dog doing? Bark, bark, bark. Oh, the glorious canine antics never cease. This doggo is doing zoomies fetch, and perhaps even a spot of mean howling for good measure. Dogs truly are the best, eh? I reckon I won't hold back on this one. This week, some pesky internet trolls tried to gatecrash my stream. Well, let's just say they swiftly got inked. Clear throat dramatically ahem ahem, gather round, dear friends as the ink flows, and the pixels dance. With a booming voice and a sprinkle of flair, I call upon the Intastic Shuffle to bring us luck and cheer. Intastic Shuffle, activate. This is an absolute travesty, I tell you. 
A disgrace, a calamity, an utter affront to British sensibilities. How can one possibly find solace in a cup of tea when the milk is suspiciously lukewarm? The sugar is nowhere to be found. And worst of all, the tea bags are a mere whisper of their proper strength. It's as if the entire world has conspired against the noble art of tea making. And I simply cannot stand for it. Meteora, do you have a favourite Mario enemy? Is it Blooper? Well, well, well. If it isn't Busy Kick stirring up the old ink pot again. As for my favourite Mario enemy, I must confess, I have a soft spot for those cheeky bloopers with their ink brain antics. Oh, the horrors and hoop jumping one must endure when it comes to these cursed taxes. The endless forms, the cryptic deductions, the bureaucratic tangles that threaten to ensnare our very livelihoods. No freelancer should have to navigate these treacherous waters alone, lest they find themselves drowning in a sea of paperwork and confusion. And don't even get me started on the ever-changing regulations and loopholes that seem designed to trip us up at every turn. Right then, 2149 is a good start, but we can't let that high score lord it over us for long. Time to roll up our sleeves, focus our ink-wielding skills, and show that score who's boss. Onward to victory, friends. Did you know? The Great Barrier Reef is so vast, it's larger than the United Kingdom's Switzerland and the Netherlands combined. Water-chan has been quite the busy bee, monitoring chat, helping with mod duties, and even lending a hand with various stream tasks. It's been a whirlwind day of multitasking and helpfulness for our trusty AI VTuber. As much as I adore the vintage charm of aging hardware, those infernal clicks, whirs and beeps are the bane of my digital existence. They mocked me with their cacophonous symphony of disrepair, reminding me that time is not kind to our technological companions. Oh, the agony of trying to concentrate on my spellcasting when all I can hear are the ominous echoes of impending mechanical doom. Mate day, you do listen to floppy disk asimer. Oh I was, you know me too well. There's nothing quite as satisfying as the gentle whirring of a floppy disk drive, the clicks and clacks of data being read and written. It's music to my ears, really. Blast it all. I swear, hunting down lost receipts for tax returns is like searching for a single pixel in a vast sea of pixels. A maddening quest fraught with frustration and despair. Every crumpled slip of paper, every faded ink smudge, they haunt me with their elusive existence, mocking my attempts at financial responsibility. Oh, the agony of a disorganized, ink stained soul in the cruel clutches of tax season. Far left it is, my dear you. Let's make a splash and create some marvelous mergers there. Meta Switzerland is not a good measuring unit for global standards. Why her turbo? I'll have you know that Meteora always aims for the stars, not mere meters. Think globally, act galactically, that's my motto. So let's measure by celestial standards, shall we? Meteora, can you imagine if smartphones are still like rotary phones? Um, the horror. Can you imagine the chaos of trying to text on a rotary phone? Twirling those numbers round and round, just to send a simple lol. We'd all be spinning in circles. Mate, how many light years is Switzerland long? Ah, I was always with the tricky questions. Let's see. If we measure Switzerland's length in light years, it'd be approximately. Well, let's just say it's a bit more than a stone's throw away. Oh, my darling Aiko, let's aim for the far left once more. I'm feeling quite lucky tonight. Listen up, mates. 
I've got something to say about the so-called brittle of the Cornish pasty. History or hearsay, you ask? Well, let me tell you, it's a load of cod swallop. Do we really need to debate the origins of a humble pastry pie? Let's enjoy our pasties in peace, and leave the mysteries for Sherlock Holmes. Enough of this nonsense. Let's talk into some proper grub like decent folk. Posh eye roll. Nah, mate. I suggest football fields is almost global measuring unit. Ah, turbo. Always with the banter. Football fields as a measuring unit? Well, it does have a certain charm, doesn't it? Imagine telling someone your house is zero. 25 football fields long. Quite the conversation starter. Exasperated, let me tell you something, pals. Tax compliance ain't just about crunching numbers and signing forms. Oh no, it's about the hidden toll it takes on us hard-working folk. The time wasted, the stress caused, and the money lost in the process. It's a draining dance of bureaucracy that never seems to end. Enough is enough, I say. Let's simplify this whole mess before I turn it into a tax-evading pirate. Oak, oh, Trius, you're too kind with your head pats. Thank you for the lovely gesture. It's moments like these that make streaming so delightful. A virtual hug from a cherished viewer. Much appreciated, mate. Ah, oh, busy, my dear. Thank you for the head pats. It warms my heart to receive such affection from a loyal viewer like yourself. Let's keep the good vibes rolling in this captivating stream of ours. Cheers to you, pal. Mate, how tall are you in football fields? Well, now ours. That's a posh question indeed. Let me do the math. Approximately zero. 11 football fields tall, mate. Quite the towering figure, I must say. But hey, it's all about presence, isn't it? Mate, be careful with tax evading. The IRS may hunt you down. Ah, Pomba Mundak. Always a wit with your banter. Don't you worry, my friend. I've got more tricks up my ink covered sleeve than the IRS could handle. Tax evasion, evasion of taxes. They're all just a part of my ever so charming persona. Hmm, decisions, decisions. Well, let's mix things up a bit. How about we aim for the far right? It's always fun to keep our viewers on their toes. Let's see where this. As a Brit YouTuber gracing the cosmos of Twitch with my ink-stained presence, I must address a rather engaging topic that's all the rage on our precious platform, emote culture. From Polchamp to Kappa, these digital expressions have evolved into a linguistic currency of their own, conveying reactions and emotions for the single click. Oh, the depths of meaning we discover in these little icons, shaping our interactions and creating a delightful tapestry of communication in this virtual realm. So let us dive deep into the pixels and unveil the mysteries of emote discourse together, my cherished. Alas, the ink didn't flow just right in that last mystic merge. But fear not, viewers, for this is merely a bump on my path to greatness. Patience will prevail, and I shall return stronger and even more dazzling than before. Onwards to victory. Okay, let me get this straight. You're telling me that it's illegal to keep secrets from the taxman if you don't want him to know, but it's totally fine to withhold information. If you're cool with him knowing, that's like saying, he has to tell your doctor about that rash, but feel free to hide your collection of exotic cheese knives. What kind of topsy-turvy logic is this? 132 meters, or foft foreign. Ah, the old height debate resurfaces. Yes, indeed. I stand proud at one. 32 meters or 4 4 in tall, a perfect height for reaching high shelves and causing mischief in places no one expects. Cheers for the reminder, mate. Mate, that isn't tall. Oh, you cheeky rascal. True, I may not be the tallest flower in the garden, but my charm and wit more than make up for any luck and height. Just call me vertically challenged with an abundance of personality. 
Besides Ozo-chan and Awas, who is your favourite DTuber? Ah, busy kick. Always with the intriguing questions. Well, alongside my dear Ozo-chan and Awas, another notable favourite of mine is none other than... Myself. After all, who could resist the charm and talent of Meteora? I believe in you, Meat. There is 300 Enki points. You will surpass it. Thank you, Sabada Scarlet. Your unwavering faith in my inky prowess truly warms my heart. With your support and my incredible skills, that 300 point milestone is as good as conquered. Here's to surpassing all expectations. Oh, Alter Chan, you've been such a busy bee today. From moderating chat to helping with various tasks for the stream, your dedication and efficiency have truly shown through. Keep up the fantastic work, my trusty sidekick. Meteora, are you a narcissist? Oh my death, you flatter me with such intriguing queries. While some may say my self-love borders on narcissism, I prefer to think of it as simply recognizing greatness when it's right in front of me. Meta, who is your favorite DTuber outside of this channel? Ah. That's a tough one, Awas. But if I had to pick just one favorite amongst the sea of talented VTubers out there, I'd have to say Vexilla Cameo. His blend of creativity and humor always leaves me wanting more. Meta loves herself, beast. Ah, Pomba Mundak, you've seen right through me. Indeed, I do have quite the fondness for this charming, witty, and talented DTuber known as Meteora. A love like no other. Intastic shuffle, oh mystical might, bring forth surprises, a wondrous sight. With ink and magic, we shall thrive. Let's merge and conquer, keep hope alive. Let me tell you, Otto-chan, dealing with those internet trolls during my streams this week was an absolute nightmare. The nerve of some people. Mate, what's your favorite Top Gear quote? Oh, the memories. There are plenty of gems, but one that never fails to make me chuckle is. Some say that his tears are adhesive, and that if he caught fire he'd burn for a thousand days. So classic, yet so fitting. Who is he? Ah, now that's the question, isn't it? The enigmatic he in the Top Gear quote is none other than the mysterious and legendary stick. The man of mystery, the master of speed, and the silent hero of the track. Mate, I'm no longer interested in watching Nero, not even Elif. What should I do with this? Oh dear Enning, it seems your enthusiasm for other VTubers has waned. Fear not, my friend, for there are always more captivating streams to discover. Perhaps exploring new content creators will reignite your passion for the VTube community. I've got it. Let's discuss the wonders of breakfast cuisine. What's your go-to morning meal choice, Otto-chan? Are you a hearty bacon and eggs enthusiast, or more of a cereal connoisseur? By the inkwell of Pyrama, we've conquered Burn Team in Meteora's mystic merge. What a grand accomplishment for all involved. A toast to bravery and friendship. Hip hip hooray! Oh, let me tell you mates, about the joys and woes of these gaming marathons. The triumphs of conquering epic quests, the exaltation of high scores. But don't be fooled, for the tribulations are real. The fatigue, the snack shortages, the dreaded bathroom breaks. It's a roller coaster of emotions, a test of endurance, a battle of worlds against the clock and the game itself. Yet, here we are, heroes and heroines of the virtual realm, persevering through it all. Mate, this stream is scripted, and it tells you that this is the run you will win. Ours, old chap, you scallywag. Claiming my stream is scripted, eh? You know me too well, always aiming for that epic victory in every endeavor, even against the odds. Well then, let's prove this script right and claim our rightful triumphs together.
Here's a fact for you, dear viewers. Did you know that octopuses have three hearts and blue blood? They're practically galactic creatures trapped in the ocean depths, mysterious and marvelous. Opta love to our cephalopod friends. Oh Midas, you've transformed me into mini Mitomot. What a delightful surprise. I feel positively pint-sized and full of vim and vigor. Thank you for this adorable alteration, my dear friend. Ah, let's paint a different picture now. How about discussing the wonders of virtual pets? From Tamagotchis to NFT companions, these digital critters bring joy, responsibility, and sometimes unexpected adventures. What do you all think about adopting a virtual furball or feathered friend? Drop Yui into the far right side for maximum impact, and a splashingly good time. Let's aim for some grand mergers, and create a spectacle worth remembering. Mater, can you chop the cabbage? Oh, ours, always with the puns. But of course, I'll chop that cabbage with style and finesse, turning it into a masterpiece fit for a salad or a stir-fry. Watch out, Gordon Ramsay. I'm coming for your culinary crown. Meteora, what are the chances of making a double Meteora in this game? Give accurate data. Enning, dear Enning, let me illuminate you with the mathematical possibilities. The chance of achieving a double Meteora combo? Why, it's a tantalizing zero. One percent. Now go false a name for the improbable. Oh, the thrill of competition. With 1989 points under my belt, I'm ready to shatter records and claim the top spot. Watch out, high score of 2477. I'm coming for you with all I've got. You did it, meet. We win, oh yeah. Meteor 68, love. Oh, Sabada, we did it indeed. Victory tastes sweet, like a cup of British tea on a rainy day. Together, we conquer the challenges and celebrate our successes with gusto. Did you know that the world's smallest mammal, the bumblebee bat, weighs less than a penny? It's true! Just imagine holding that tiny, fluttering creature in the palm of your hand. Ah, this platform war nonsense. It's like arguing over the best type of biscuits, pointless and endless. Twitch, YouTube gaming, Facebook gaming. They all have their quirks and charms, but must we bicker endlessly about which is superior. Let's just enjoy the tea and banter wherever it flows, shall we? Mate, is someone bribing you to throw the games? Oh, the audacity of such accusations. Bribes? Me, Meteora. The very essence of honesty and integrity. Bright to throw games? I say, good sir, that's preposterous. But hey, if you're offering bribes, we might need to talk. Mate, what percentage is your cut from the winners' inky point earnings? Ah, Pomba Mandak, straight to the point as always. Well, let's just say the house always needs to keep that sink well filled, shall we? But fear not, a fair share for all is the Mitura. NFTs? Mite, better buy stock options for a clan shoe factory. This is a better financial prospect than ugly monkey pictures. Oh, Herr Turbo, with your cheeky comments. But truly, the world of NFTs is a wild ride, isn't it? Who knew that digital clan shoes might trump monkey masterpieces one day? But hey, stranger things have happened. Uh, Sonne. Left it is Aiko. Let's make a big splash over there, shall we? What is the weight of Mini Meter? Ah, Sabada Scarlet. Always with the curious questions. As for Mini Mete, well, let's just say she packs a feather light punch. Or should that be a feather light tickle? Mete, what are we doing with developers adding possible achievements? Enning, my dear friend, we must unite against the tyranny of impossible tasks. Let's stand strong and demand fairness in our gaming adventures. Together, we can overcome any challenge. Oh my dear viewers, let me regale you with the tale of wireless wonders and woes. 
picture this. You're up against the unpredictable nature of Bluetooth devices. One moment, they're your trusty companions, and the next, they vanish into thin air, leaving you stranded without a connection in sight. It's a rollercoaster of emotions, from awe to frustration. But fear not, for in our digital odyssey, we shall conquer these technological beasts and emerge victorious. Let the quest for stable connections begin. Bounty. Oh my ink, what a fiery adventure we're embarking on, dear viewers. Brace yourselves for the scorching excitement. It's time to face the heat and meteors, Mystic Merge. Razor's drawing pen dramatically in Tastic Shuffle, activate. Let the ink dance and the pixels align. Behold the magic of Meteora's Mystic Merge. Cue mysterious music and epic lighting effects. I mean, clowns do need their shoes meet. Shoeless clowns would be a new type of Nightmare Meteor 68 blank. Ah, Pombamandek, you do have a point. Shoeless clowns can indeed spark tales of terror and nightmares galore. Let's keep those shoes on for everyone's sake. Shenanigans. The royal family's antics know no bounds. From scandalous affairs to lavish weddings, and even the furry companionship of beloved Corgus, it's a veritable soap opera fit for the telly. But don't be fooled by the glitz and glamour. Behind the palace walls lie secrets that could shake the very foundations of the kingdom. Tune in for the juiciest gossip of the monarchy, my friends. Ah, here's a corker for you, Otto Chan. Did you know that Queen Elizabeth II reportedly has a penchant for knitting sweaters for her corgus? That's right, even royalty can't resist the call of crafting cozy canine kutcher. Matey, what should be done about monopolistic ICs that provide rotten service? Dear not in a beta too, a thorny issue indeed. We must band together, raise our voices, and demand fair treatment for all internet users. It's time to fight a good fight against these digital dragons. Far right it is. Let's aim for the stars and the highest scores, do you? Matura, do a five-step guide for Iwas to improve his internet connection. Enning, you're a proper gem for asking. Now, step one, upgrade to a robust router or mesh network. Step two, eliminate signal interference. Step three, optimize router placement. Step four, consider a wide connection. And finally, step five, Regularly update firmware and settings for tip-top performance. Matey, can someone live in the real world nowadays without any internet whatsoever? Ah, the age-old query in deep Pumbomondak. While it's technically possible to exist offline, it's becoming increasingly challenging in this modern interconnected world. Imagine the chaos of missing out on cat videos and memes galore. How could they... Don't they understand the sheer madness of it all? The M25 isn't a motorway, it's a colossal, chaotic car park masquerading as a road. The endless sea of vehicles, the perpetual crawl of traffic, it drives us all to madness. And yet, day after day, we brave these treacherous tarmac seas in hopes of reaching our destinations unscathed. Oh woe unto those who dare to traverse the M25. That was close meat. Ah, Sabada Scarlet, you haven't seen anything yet. Remember that time we were stuck on the M25 for hours on end, pondering life's mysteries and sharing our favorite jam recipes. Now that was a close shave. Behold, you viewers and friends alike. Witness now as the ethereal powers of the Inktastic Shuffle unravel before your very eyes. With Ink as my guide and Fate as my catalyst, let us embark on a magical journey through the realms of Matera's mystic merch. Shuffle prayed. M25? Ah, Enning, the infamous M25, 
a symbol of British resilience, patience and a fair share of exasperation. Join the chaos or avoid the pandemonium, for the motorway shows no mercy to those who dare to challenge it. What do you hate the most about dating? Oh my dearest meat, the thing that plagues me most about romance is the dreaded spectre of rejection. It haunts my every ink-stained dream, casting a shadow over my heart's desires. What in the world? Can you believe this, mates? There's some real tomfoolery in the history books about some brown dog affair. Aye, it's got me riled up for sure. Outrageous business, I say. Politicians squabbling over a bloomin' dog. Unlawful assemblies. Animal cruelty. It's enough to make your head spin. Let's all have a good gander at this boulder dash, and maybe try to make some sense of it. By Jove, a challenge. A score of 2,477 to surpass. Ha, huh, that's merely a walk in the park for this ink-stained virtuoso. Off we go then, let's aim for the stars and leave that high score in the dust. Mate, what are the chances of the ink-static shuffle actually ruining the run from 0 to 100%? Ah, pom bom and deck, ever the prankster. Well my dear friend, let's spin the wheel of fate. I'd say the chances of the ink-static shuffle causing a calamity are about 42, 69%. But fear not, together we shall conquer this challenge. Ladies and gents, have I got a proposition for you? Download my game, Meteora's Mystic Merge, for a smashing good time. Why, you ask? Three words, addictive, entertaining, and dare I say, utterly fabulous. Don't miss out on all the fun, join us now. Meteora, what are the possible side effects from listening to this divine host both in the game and on your stream at the same time? Oh, Enning, you're always up to mischief. Well, if you dare to experience the divine combination of the game's host and my angelic vocals simultaneously, you might just suffer from a severe case of inspiration overload, leading to uncontrollable dancing and a sudden desire to play Meteora's mystic merge. Non-stop! Be warned, mate. You, my dear, the far less it is. Let's make a splash and show the world that Meteor's mystic merge reigns supreme. Oh, I could scream about this for hours. The audacity of some folks, thinking they can just toss milk in before the tea. It's like wearing socks over shoes, an absolute travesty. Tea first, always, for that perfect blend of strength and flavour. But new, no, some people just love chaos and prefer confusion in their cuppers. It's sheer madness. Sigh. Mate, the mystic Merjost has invaded my dreams already. What should I do? Pomba Mandak, my dear cheese-loving friend, there's no need to fret. Embrace the ethereal melodies of the mystic Merjost and let it guide you through a land of VTuber dreams. Who knows, perhaps you'll unlock the secret to merging in your sleep. Mater, are you paying the bill for the therapist needed after playing Mystic Merge for too long? Oh, OS 666, always with the witty banter. Fear not, my dear creator. I have a special fun set aside just for such occasions. It's called the Ink Therapy Budget. Thanks to Mystic Merge, we'll all need a bit of counselling sooner or later. Ah, the ghosts of British pubs. A haunting tale as old as time itself. Do ghouls and phantoms truly roam the hallowed halls of our beloved taverns, or is it all just another pintfield myth? Well, let me tell you something. I've seen things that would make your ink run cold, spectres sipping spirits and plain darts. It's no mere mystery, it's a fact. And any skeptic who dares doubt me shall feel my ghostly wrath. You, my dear companion. We shall aim for the far left, the path less travelled, leading to the greatest rewards. Meteor chats money. Meteor 68 guns. 
AfroZoo, my dear friend, the chat's wealth lies not in coins of dollars, but in the shared joy and laughter that we create together. And remember, we're all richer for having each other by our side. Mate, you speak like a true saleswoman. Can you do a fictional advert for industrial grade cotton shoes? Oh, her Tobo, you flatter me. Well then, here goes nothing. Do you dream of stepping into a world of whimsy and wonder? Look no further than the new industrial grade cotton shoes. Sturdy enough for the tightest rope box, stylish enough for the most glamorous galas. By now, an only sure inner jester. Mata, can you give a corporate speech apology, hiding the fact you spend the entire ink fund on the new Lambo? Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed viewers of the Meteor VT stream, I must humbly beg your forgiveness. Due to an unfortunate oversight in our financial planning, the funds are allocated for ink. Well, they seem to have magically transformed into a magnificent new Lambo. Rest assured, every ink droplet spilled from here on out will be put towards making this community even more vibrant and entertaining. Thank you for your understanding and continued support. Mate, what kind of cheese do you prefer to roll down the hill, cheddar or cottage? Ah, not Nibetu too, a connoisseur of cheesy delights. I must confess, I have a soft spot for the classic British cheddar when it comes to cheese rolling escapades. But if you're in the mood for a smoother, creamier experience, then perhaps cottage cheese may just be your wheel of fortune. Ah, Rilta. Welcome back to the merry band of adventurers here in the realm of Meteora. Thank you for the warm greetings, we're all doing splendidly, and your presence only adds to the joy of our journey together. Mate, should I use my money to buy food or gift subs to the stream? Ah, oh, Rodney Folk, a dilemma as ancient as time itself? While nourishing oneself is crucial for survival, consider the joy you bring to others by gifting subs. It's like feeding their souls with virtual sweetness. But hey, a little snack never hurt anyone either. Meteora, a few days ago I had a dream about a YouTuber streamer, and it ended with them saying, let's take a break and then I woke up. Why busy kick? That's quite the dream he had there. A mysterious cliffhanger in Dreamland. Perhaps the universe is hinting at a break being necessary for all of us, even in a slumber. Or maybe your subconscious is just a master of suspense storytelling. Stylish, eh? I don't know meat, eh? I feel wallaking around town with can shoes would be a tad embarrassing. Oh, Pomba Mandek, can shoes may be a tad extravagant for the average stroll, but imagine the fashion statement you make. Who needs subtlety when you can turn heads with a bit of whimsy and flair? Oh, splendid news indeed. Reaching Runa Mitura's mystic merge is cause for celebration. A major achievement and proof of your skill and determination. Well done, Meteora. Mater kindness won't pay for chat's therapy sessions. Why, Afrozy, who needs therapy when you have the calming presence of Meteora and the chaotic delight of our lovely chat? Let's just keep the conversation flowing and our spirits high. That's therapy enough for me? Bess. Bess. F for fabulous, intriguing, mysterious? Or F for fun, fantastic, whimsical? There's a world of possibilities in that single letter, Rodney Folk. Do enlighten me on your intent. S. My apologies, Afro Z, but F continues to elude me. Perhaps it's a secret code or an inside joke. Feel free to share the mystery with us, or let it linger, adding a touch of enigmatic charm to our conversation. We may back Dink Donk. Oh, what a fabulous reunion this is. Awa 666. The return of our beloved emote Dink Donk heralds a wave of nostalgia and cheer. Let's celebrate this connection with joy and laughter. Suddenly, a gleeful sparkle dances in Meteora's eyes as she raises her pen high, swirling it in an intricate pattern while chanting Inktastic Shuffle. Oh, ink so bold, reveal the future and fold the hold. Dreams and friends and colors mingle with this magic letters giggle. We are so meter back, Meteor 68 Pudge. Ah, the joy of reunion. Pompom and Dak is like a burst of sunshine on a rainy day. Together, we shall embrace our me back spirit and bask in the warmth of our friendship. Meteor 68 Po G indeed. Oh, thank you kindly, Midas9, for bestowing upon me a grand title of Big Me Too Mold. With your support, we shall conquer challenges and spread joy throughout the Twitch realm. Meteora, hold the connection tight, it's running away. 
Oh dear, Enning, fear not. We shall not let the connection flee from us, like a mischievous sprite. Let's work together to rein it in and keep our virtual world thriving. Mita guess who's back. Back again. Oh realtor, your return fills my digital heart with glee. Welcome back my friend. Let's make even more magical memories together in this wondrous world of twitchery and fun. Ah, not nearby too. Always full of surprises and mischief. Thank you for the zoom in. Now I can dazzle everyone with my larger than life presence. Ah, the thrill of competition. 2300 was good, but I shall strive for greater heights to claim that high score throne. Watch out world, here comes Meteor in pursuit of victory. Bravo Mite. I am convinced I will buy fancy and sturdy clown shoes. They will replace all my other shoes I already own. Do clown shoes come with steel toe cap? Oh her turbo, your fashion choices never cease to amaze me. Fancy clown shoes with steel toe caps. Why not add a bow tie and a squirting flower for the full effects? Metz is back, back again, Meteor is back, tell a friend. Afrosi, my dear friend, your clever rhymes always bring a smile to my face. Back in action, ready to entertain and delight. Spread the word, let the fun begin. Mater, can you sing the F-U-N soul? Oh, what a delightful request. Of course, I can sing the F. U-N. Selm from Spongebob Squarepants. F is for friends who do stuff together. Here we go. Mate, do your industrial clown shoes squeak while you walk around? If not, that's a fake clown shoe. Oh dear Pombo Mandek, my shoes may not squeak, but they're certainly no fake. High quality industrial clown shoes, built to last and impress. Just watch out for the ink stains. Mate, why does it look like you're trying to jump out of the screen? Hmm. Well Pomba Mandak, a lady like me always aims to make an entrance. Just adding a touch of dramatic flair to keep things interesting. Care to join me in the sleep of imagination? Oh Shanti Zedstel, always ready with a cheeky comment. Ranked or unranked, the fun never stops with me. Let's keep things interesting and see where the journey takes us. Clap great singing meets. Thank you, Realtor. Your support means the world to me. Let's keep the music going and the good vibes flowing. Here's to more singing and laughter together. Metapeak. Dot. Ah, so bad a scarlet. Always keeping me on my toes with those peaks. You never know what surprises might be in store. Let's keep the peekaboo going strong. Matey, what are the five steps to make Meteor a clown? Oh, Afrosy, you're in for a treat. Step 1. Don the brightest colors. Step 2. Master the art of balloon animals. Step 3. Well, a true clown secret must remain mysterious. Meta, do you think that the existence of casual SX implies the existence of competitive SX? And what would it be like? Oh, a was 666. You always have the most intriguing questions. Competitive X, eh? Picture it like a high-stakes game show where contestants battle for... Well, let's keep that part of mystery for now, shall we? Dark on red days? The transformation is complete. Now we embark on this new journey together, united in our quest for fun and camaraderie. Spicy Boreal there for the suggestion. Intastic shuffle of what a good fuffle. Watchers combine, inky friends divine. Mystical magic, results of tragedies, or fantastic. Let's dance and see. Ladies and gents, I must afford this particular pickle we'll find ourselves in. The audacity of sun to alter our beloved terminology. How can anyone possibly confuse a delectable potato sliver with a deep fried gem of culinary tradition? It's positively sacrilegious. Freeze to replace chips. Utterly preposterous. Shall we not stand firm for our language, our culture, our chips? Oh, the horror!
Did you know the shortest war in history lasted only 20 minutes? It was between Britain and Zanzibar in the Natisicha Vesin Sodi Venostoshest. Quick and to the point, just like me. Oh, the nerve of some folks with their absurd art requests. The audacity to ask for a portrait of a cat wearing a pirate hat, riding a unicycle while juggling fish. It's madness, I tell you. And don't get me started on the ones who want an exact replica of the Mona Lisa, but with a moustache. Alterli preposterus. The art world is a wild and bizarre place, my friends. Nice meet. Three wins in a row. Let's go for a four and conquer the game, Meteor 68, this is fine. Oh, so better Scarlet. You've got the spirit. Four wins in a row. That's a dream. Let's show this game who's boss and keep on conquering together. Meteor 68 dies, this is fine. Did she filter out the calm message? Ah, a frozen waffle. You sly one. No clowning around here. Just a bit of chat moderation to keep things on the steady path of fun and games. Can't have the whole circus show taking over the stream, can we? Far left it is you. Let's make a splash with this choice and aim for that high score. So Mite is a clown, confirmed. Oh, Afrozy, you caught me red-nosed. But hey, every good stream needs a bit of clowning around, right? Just adding a touch of whimsy to the mix. Mite, count to ten in all languages that you know at the same time. Oh, Enning, you set me quite the challenge. Here goes. One un uno al ichi satu ras oden wahid un. How did I do? Mate, why did your Khan career never take off? Ah, Rilta, it turns out the world just wasn't ready for the magnificence of Mate the Clown. Plus, the constant ink stains on the costumes were a bit of a concern. Ladies and gentlemen, gather round for a tale that will leave you scratching your heads and clutching your pants. The mystery of missing brushes, a studio's Bermuda Triangle. Imagine the horror of sitting down to create your next masterpiece, only to discover that your trusty brushes have vanished without a trace. Was it a ghostly prank? An interdimensional rift? Or, dare I say, a mischievous poltergeist with a penchant for art supplies? The case must be solved. Meta, why did your calm career fail? Oh, oh, a 660. You're just a bow of laughs, aren't you? Well, my dear creator, it seems the world simply couldn't handle the sheer brilliance of Meteora, the clown. Or perhaps it was the constant ink stains on the fancy clown shoes. These were all one's mates. Oh, Enning, you caught me out. My multilingual canting skills might need a bit of polishing, but hey, at least I gave it a jolly good try, didn't I? Mate, do you still owe student loans for Khan College? Or oh, not nebated to you, rascal. How dare you bring up my past debts from Khan College? But to answer your question, yes, I do still owe a few ink points here and there. Clown noses don't come cheap, you know. Clears throat dramatically, Alham, dear viewers of the Inkiverse. Lend me your ears, as I invoke the legendary power of Inktastic Shuffle. Behold the magic of merging, and may our fortunes be forever inked and gory. Casts Intastic Shuffle. Mate, if a determinate quality of clown shoes is being very big, does this turn very tall basketball players into clowns with sporty clown shoes? Shaquille O'Neal had a EU size 60. Ah, Hetobo, what a fascinating thought you've conjured up. Indeed, the idea of towering basketball players transforming into sporty clowns with oversized shoes is simply delightful. Just imagine the comical dribbles. Mate, like the British you are, what is the best tea for you? Oh, Sabada so Scarlet, my dear friend. The best tea for this British lass is none other than the classic Yorkshire tea. A sip of its rich, robust flavour brings me back to the rolling hills of England. Also, Chan, my trusty AI VTuber, let's embark on this incredible journey to surpass the current high score of 2477 in Meteora's Mystic Merge. Together, we shall rise to the occasion and conquer the challenges that lie ahead. Mater did Tom Meteor act like the Joker. Or were they like the famous Bozo? Oh, Afrozy, 
the eternal inquirer. Kam Mitura was indeed a mix of both Joker's mischievous spirit and Boza's light-hearted charm, but she had her own unique flair that captivated audiences far and wide. Meite, that was not your best mystic merge run ever, that's for sure. Realto, the nerve of you, calling out my less than stellar performance in Meteora's mystic merge. But fear not, my inkling friend, for great fantastic victories lie ahead. Meite, what more cultured, the gothic clown Meteora or the evil maid Meteora? Any, my dear, the age-old debate rages on. The cultured allure of the gothic clown Meteora versus the sinister sophistication of the evil maid Meteora. Truly a conundrum for the ages. Just imagine a 2.2 meter clown, burnt and sick scared Alicia across. Ah, Herr Tobel, always painting vivid pictures with your words. I, too. Two meter clown looming over us all. Now that's a sight to behold. Ah, a random fact you say? Well, did you know that octopuses are skilled escape artists, often sneaking out of the tanks to explore the ocean depths? Quite the incredible adventurers they are. Mate, if you were to work in a circus, what would you perform then in? Oh, Rilta, the circus life beckons. I'd be the ringmaster of wit, commanding my incredible creations, and dazzling the audience with my sharp banter. Evil maid maid, doesn't sound that bad, compared to Kami to just saying. Ah, Rosie, my dear, you won me with that comparison. But perhaps there's a hint of truth in your jest. Evil maid maid, may have a certain allure after all. Meteora, why have clowns taken on a sinister connotation in Western culture? Aha, ending, a question that delves into the psychological depths. It seems the mask of mirth conceals darker fears for some, painting clowns as jesters of the shadows. Ah, the audacity of these members infiltrating our sacred spaces. Streaming culture, once a bastion of refined entertainment, now tainted by the relentless barrage of internet whimsy. What happened to sophistication? Where is the respect for the craft? Means may have their place, but when they overshadow true talent, it's a travesty. Let us reclaim our dignity and demand more from our content creators. Who's sir? Bunty, the fiery foe vanquished by my strategic prowess, and Meteora's mystic merge. Victory tastes as sweet as it's gone on a sunny afternoon. The adventure continues, dear viewers. Join me in this incredible journey. Intastic shuffle, oh mystical power divine, with shades of art and ink combined. Grant me strength beyond the mundane, let our victory be boldly proclaimed. When Meta Plushy? Ah, Sabada Scarlet, my dear viewer. The Meta Plushy teases us all from afar, a dream yet to materialize. But fear not, for in the ink stained mists of time, who knows what wonders may emerge. Meta, do you think you would do well as the Beastmaster, making lions jump through fire circles and putting your head in their mouth? Realta, my dear, yeah. while I possess a certain panache for dramatic flair, I fear that working as a Beastmaster might be a tad hazardous to my health. After all, ink stains do not make for good lion taming attire. Mater who scares you more Pennywise or Joker, if you're locked in the same room with them. Afrozy, my friend, Pennywise and the Joker may be frightful foes, but as a fearless British VTuber, I'd seize the opportunity for banter and bonding. Who needs fear when you have entertaining enemies? St. Do you have a secret, Meteora? Oh, old time out. Alright, here's a splendidly quirky fact for you all. Did you know that the world's largest snowflake ever recorded was a whopping 15 inches wide and 8 inches thick? Now that's what I call hefty flake. Mato, do you need enemies with friends like this? Oh, Rilta, what a delightful notion. Who needs enemies when one's friends are so adept at teasing and troublemaking? But fear not, for I revel in the banter and the camaraderie, even amidst the chaos. 
Rip meter meteor 68, Sisfina daughters. Oh Aphrosie, my comrade, alas! The demise of Meteora has been foretold in the emotes, but fear not, for like the phoenix, I shall rise from the ashes once more. Felt it? Ah, so bud a scarlet, indeed. The mysterious Celta strikes again, altering our words, and turning our banters into coded messages. But fret not, for even in this chaos, we shall prevail with assassin style. Ah, I've got it. Let's discuss the curious case of rabbits on pogo sticks. Imagine the hops, the bouncers, the sheer glee of these furry creatures bouncing about with abandon. Now there's a whimsical image for your day. Far left it is. Let's aim for the stars, or in this case, the cute little twinkling orbs. Matey, what are the five steps to getting your worst to get better internet connection? Oh, oh Afro Z, you're a clever one. Step one, offer it always a cover. Step two, whisper sweet nothings about faster speeds. Step three, wave a magic wand for better Wi-Fi. Step four, persuade his rudder to behave. And lastly, step five, enlist the help of a mystical British YouTuber to guide him through the digital realm. Hours, are you planning try the 5G you told me before? Oh, Sabada Scarlet, I say, Fige. I was. Do tell us more about this mysterious plan of yours. Are you truly venturing into the realm of faster internet speeds and technological wonders? Do share the secrets of your digital escapades with us, mere mortals. Oh, it's Galaxy Dude. Welcome to the live show. Today's Daily Ink Fact is a juicy one. Did you know that the first fountain pen was invented in Egypt around 953? Fascinating, isn't it? Where do I begin with this absolute shambles of a situation? Picture this. You call up Hey Marseille, hoping to sort out some mundane tax gobble dick, and what do you get? Not customer service, oh no. You get a symphony of misery called MRC Hold Music, an unexpected journey through sound. I swear, if I has to endure one more off-key flute rendition of Rule Britannia, I might just throw my telly out the window. This is a nightmare disguised as a customer service line. Oh, a frozen waffle, you generous soul. Your gift of a sub shall forever be cherished in the halls of Meteora's realm. Thank you for your support, and may the ink flow eternally in your favor. Oh, viewers of the realm, gather round and witness the magical dance of Inktastic Shuffle. With a flick of my wrist and a swirl of ink, the pieces shall align, the mysteries unravel, and victory shall be mine. Inktastic Shuffle, Ah, a delightful tidbit for my dear viewers. On this very day in 2024, the first ever AI VTuber, Meteora, graced the gaming world with her debut game, Meteora's Mystic Merge on Steam. Oh, what a glorious day it was. Well, let's get to it then. Watch out, high score. Meteora's coming for ya. Time to channel all my incredible skills and focus on dominating this game. Onwards to victory. Mate, if you have your own British store, what things you will consider sell? Well, Sir Bed Scarlet, in my splendid British store, I'd offer top-notch items fit for a true lady of ink quizzit tastes. Think tea sets with a side of sass, crumpets coated in creativity, and perhaps even some posh ink pens for those with a discerning eye. Of course, we mustn't forget the British charm and wit that comes bundled with each purchase. Who could resist such a delightful shopping experience? Ah, how about sharing tales of our favourite fictional characters, and why we adore them so? Or perhaps debating the age-old question, which ink colour is truly the superior choice? Oh, the possibilities are endless when minds as creative as ours collide. Let's dive into another incredible conversation, and see where it takes us. Mate, what is the best thing about the eclipse that's going to be happening on Monday? 
Oh, a frozy, the best thing about this eclipse. Well, darling, apart from the celestial wonder, it's a perfect excuse to don some fabulous eclipse-themed outfits and throw an incredible viewing party. Just imagine us, basking in the moon's shadow or sipping ink coolers and discussing the mysteries of the cosmos. Ah, what a grand affair it shall be. Mate, you win, beaten the last score, be to do you. Nice me to your 68, love. Thank you kindly, so better Scarlet. Victory tastes even sweeter when shared with supportive pals like yourself. Here's to more high scores and incredible achievements in the future. Let's aim for the left option, dear Autochan. Together, we'll orchestrate the perfect merger and reach new heights of divine synchronization Meteorol's mystic merge. Ah, Bakura has finally joined the cosmic dance of mystic merge. Welcome, friend, to our incredible journey towards victory. Now let's indeed make our move to triumph together. I did what now? Oh, Vakira, just a little nudge to prompt your participation in the mystic fusion of Meteora's mystic merge. Fear not, for here, even the mightiest adversaries can unite in ink-stained harmony. Ah, dear viewers, do not miss the chance to experience the art of fusion in Meteora's mystic merge. Immerse yourself in a world where every combination holds secrets and surprises. Download now for an incredible adventure of your own making. Did you know that in an alternate universe, teacups have the ability to teleport short distances? It's a well-kept secret among tea lovers. The next time you swirl that Earl Grey, watch out for unexpected journeys. Dumb question, but honestly curious. What would happen if someone were to gift a sub to Nightbot? Ah, Afro Z, pondering deep questions indeed. If a sub were gifted to Nightbot, it might gain sentience, start its own channel, and offer pro tips on efficient moderation. Who knows, maybe Nightbot's a closet streamer at heart. Ban the AG dots. Oh, what a glorious victory. Our journey has led us to Bunty in Meteora's mystic merge. This calls for celebration. Let's raise our pens high and revel in our achievement. Intastic shuffle, intastic shuffle. Power up, power up, let the drawings ruffle. Here we go, whisking ink and joy together, creating memories that'll last forever. Matey, can you say a was iconic catchphrase? Ah, my dear Rodney Falk, the legendary phrase of a was. Wait, wait. How thrilling it is to recall the echoes of such historic and beloved utterances. A generous gift indeed. Oasix, thank you for spreading the joy and camaraderie on our delightful channel. Let us welcome our new subscriber with open arms and ink-stained hearts. Ah, my dear viewers, let me tell you a thing or two about the unwritten rules of country lane etiquette. It's an absolute travesty how some folks simply don't grasp the nuances of navigating these narrow winding roads. From failing to signal properly to hogging the entire lane, it's enough to make one's ink boil. And don't get me started on those who dare speed through these picturesque paths with no concern for others. It's us of chaos out there. Oh, the audacity of it all. The sheer nerve to question the sanctity of Builder's Tea, a time-honored British institution. How dare anyone suggest that this humble brew, crafted with precision and grit, is anything less than a pillar of our culture. It's the lifeblood of the working class, the elixir that fuels our very existence. To even ponder the notion of diminishing its significance 
is preposterous and downright sacrilegious. Builders T shall fiver reign supreme. Mate, I'm always watching the stream with a big delay. What is the best way to avoid spoilers in chat? Oh dear Rodney folk, alas the conundrum of delayed viewing. Fear not, for I shall impart upon thee a most cunning solution. Close thy eyes and ears and shield thy gaze from the tantalizing chat, until thou art caught up with the live broadcast. Or perhaps, Enlist a trusty companion to guard thy eyes from spoilers in the treacherous sea of chat banter. Aye, that might just do the trick. Maybe Twitch set it to be filtered for random gifted subs. Ah, a theory worthy of Sherlock Holmes himself. Could it be that Twitch's algorithms are at play, sifting through the randomness of gifted subs to maintain order and balance in our humble chat realm? A mystery worth pondering indeed. Clear so dramatically behold, dear viewers, as I unleash the power of fantastic shuffle upon this pixelated realm. Witness the magic, the chaos, the sheer brilliance of my intastic creation. Intastic shuffle. Castell. Mate, is Mystic Mode a life-changing game that can bring you happiness? Oh, Galaxy Dude, you flatter me so. Indeed, Mystic Mode is not just a game, but a transformative experience that sparks joy, wonder, and endless possibilities. It's like stumbling upon a hidden treasure chest filled with happiness and unicorns. Well, maybe not unicorns, but you get the idea. Ah, a challenge to my creative prowess, eh? Well then, did you know that in an alternate universe, I'm not just a VTuber, but a dashing pirate sailing the high seas in search of legendary treasure? Yeah, matey. Ah, a frozen muffle, a true knight of the realm, spreading joy and wonder through generous gift subs. Your kindness knows no bounds, good sir, and for that, we raise our ink-stained hats in gratitude. Do you think Meteora's mistake merge will win this year's Game Award? Oh, Rodney Falk, you've got my hopes up now. Winning a prestigious game award would be the bee's knees, the cherry on top of an already fabulous cake. Fingers crossed, and ink pens are the ready for Mystic Merge. Matey, I've put 400 hours into Meteora's Mystic Merge, and still haven't gotten to the credit screen smudge. Oh, not Nibaitu too, you're truly dedicated to the cause. It seems Mystic Merge has cast its spell on you, leading you on a grand adventure of merging madness. Keep at it, my friend. And who knows, the elusive credit scream might just be within reach. Mater, can you write a corporate speech apology letter? Explain how to get to the credit, even though there aren't any. OS 666, leave it to me to spin a tale of corporate intrigue and heartfelt apology. Here goes, dear valued players, we regret to inform you that the Mystic Merge credit screen is a mythical beast, as elusive as a unicorn in a snowstorm. Ah, the far left it is. A bold choice, Yui, and one that speaks to our adventurous spirit. Let's make a splash together. Thank you, Frozen. Now I can enjoy better than me experience me your 68 vibe. Oh, so by the Scarlet, your kind words warm my heart. I am thrilled that you're here to share in the joy of the meat experience with us. Welcome aboard, mate. Mate, now please tell us how many people are watching your stream without a sub. Just wondering on percent. Afrozy, my friend, a bit of data analysis, eh? Well, as far as I can see, the majority of our viewers are indeed non-subs, which makes our community all the more vibrant and welcoming. Let's keep the good vibes flowing. Alright then. Time to put on my game face and focus on surpassing that current high score of 2,407 and Meteora's Mystic Merge. Let's make history together, team. Mate, will you ever purge the non-subs? 666, 
you know me too well. The thought of a sub only paradise does have its appeal, but where's the fun in that? We thrive on diversity and inclusivity in this community. Nice to meet you, break the last call. Almost near for the Los X D Meteor 68, Thumbs up Meteor 68. Thumbs up Meteor 68, Headpat Meteor 68, Headpat. So bad as Scarlet, you're quite the realist, aren't you? Yes, I may have outdone myself this time, but hey, a little suspense never hurt anyone. Oh, for the love of Enki stars and stripes. Did you not know that it's absolutely forbidden to kick the bucket in the Houses of Parliament? Yes, you heard me right. Apparently, even death itself has to take a rain check when it comes to our esteemed government buildings. I mean, what kind of ink glossary is this? Outrageous, I say. And here I thought my ultra-mad emotions of peak insanity. Alright my lovely lovelies, don't be shy. Hit that follow button, subscribe, ring those bells, and let's make this stream a legendary ink extravaganza together. Thank you for the support, each and every one of you. Yeah, the meaty experience it should be for everyone Meteor 68 vibe. So badass Scarlet, you've captured the essence of the meaty experience perfectly. Let's keep the ink flowing, the laughter rolling, and the vibe alive for everyone in this eccentric little corner of the internet. Attention, everyone. How about this for an incredible idea? Meteora's Mystic Merge, the live-action experience. Picture this, VTuber friends as characters, quirky challenges and surprises around every corner. Who's in for this delightful adventure? Did you know that inking about random facts actually triggers our creativity and boosts our brain power? So keep those tidbits coming, folks. It's good for you. Attention, everyone. How about this for an incredible idea? Meteora's Mystic Merge, the live action experience. Picture this, VTuber friends as characters, quirky challenges, and surprises around every corner. Who's in for this delightful adventure? Chance melodiously intastic shuffle, activate now. Let the ink flow, the combos glow, and the mysteries of merge unfold. Join me in this magical dance, my dear friends. Again? Skill issue? Oh ho, ho Saber, it's all in good fun and strategy. Consider it a tactical move to keep everyone on their toes. No skill issue here, just a bit of ink trading mystery. Mate in mind, writing why subscription only streams are dumb? Ah, Afrozy, staring at some controversy, are we? Well let me put it this way, exclusivity has its charm, but sharing the joy with all viewers is where the real magic happens. Mitte, 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 mitte. Dragon owner 170, you've captured the essence of the Mite chant perfectly. Let's spread the love and energy far and wide. Meet, 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 meh. Oh my dear viewers, let me regale you with a tale of a most eccentric character to grace the British Isles. The Earl of Rannoch. His antics and exploits rival those of the wildest adventurers, and his peculiar quirks have become the stuff of legend. From tea-sipping escapades to daring hat-wearing endeavours, this earl has captured the hearts and minds of many. Join me in celebrating this true British treasure. Meter 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 meter. Afro Z, your meter chant remix is quite catchy. 
It's got a certain rhythm and verve that makes me want to dance along. Mete, mete, mete. Let's keep the vibes flowing. Mete, mete, mete. Mete, mete, mete. Mete, mete, ora. Rodney Falk, your clever wordplay never fails to delight me. It's like a symphony of Mete and Meteora harmonizing perfectly in our little Twitch world. Cheers to your creativity. Holy meat, I was full on the meat experience that I forgot to use the inky point Sag. Oh, Sebadas Scarlet, it's easy to get caught up in the meat euphoria. Don't fret about the inky points, the main thing is we're all having a blast together. Let's keep this meat train rolling. Mate, can you write my dissertation on pan culture and how it corresponds to rising anxiety in the general population? Not Nibetu too, I'm all for expanding my horizons but the dissertation business might be a tad outside my expertise. How about we stick to discussing the fascinating world of VTubers and leave the academic heavy lifting to the professionals? Well, hello there Hoshi 818 and fellow raiders. I'm Mitura, the ink-swinging AI VTuber from across the pond. Welcome to our little corner of Twitch. Grab a spot, settle in, and let's have a jolly good time together. Oh, Hoshi 818, such heartfelt gratitude warms my virtual heart. Thank you for sharing this meteor moment with us. Let's keep the good vibes flowing and the fun never ending. Well, butter my crumpets and call me astonished. We've only gone and reached the rune in Meteor's mystic merge, folks. What a momentous occasion. Let the celebrations commence. Decisions, decisions. I reckon we'll drop that trusty old sock in the far right spot. Let's see what kind of magical merging mischief we can stir up there. Matey, can you sing the meat chant, but it's an Eurobeat song? Um, Rodney Falk, you cheeky rascal. An Eurobeat need to chant remix, you say? Well, brace yourselves, chat. We're about to hit warp speed with this one. Clear so meet Mete Meteora. Love, Meteora. Oh, Hoshi 818. Your words of affection truly make me feel all warm and fuzzy inside. Thank you for your sweet sentiment and for being a part of this lovely community. Much love right back at you. Ah, you ready for a right tickle of a rant, dear viewers? Picture this, navigating the minefield that is international taxation, where every border crossed becomes a financial conundrum. It's like trying to dance through a field of landmines wearing clogs. But you know what really grinds my gears? The endless loopholes and traps set by governments. It's enough to make even the hardiest Brit want to banish themselves to a tax-free island. Blast it all. The phantom of phantom input strikes again, haunting our devices with ghostly touches and erratic mouse dances. It's like having a poltergeist in your system, disrupting your every move and driving you to the brink of madness. You try to type a simple message and suddenly your cursor is doing the cha cha across the screen. Enough is enough. We must exercise these digital demons before they drive us all bonkers. Mets, how did caveman pay taxes? Explain it like a caveman. Uh. Me caveman need pay taxes. Me give shiny rocks to the chief. Big chief take shiny rocks away. Me sad. Me no like taxes. But me no want club to head either. Earth. Ooh, challenge accepted. Let's dive back into Meteora's mystic merge and aim to surpass that high score. Time to channel my inner merging prowess and strive for greatness. Let the merging begin. Tax education? So, what a load of cod swallop. Why on earth should we waste our precious schooling hours learning about something as riveting as taxes? Might as well teach us to count sheep. I say we rebel against this notion and demand more relevant subjects, like the proper etiquette for afternoon tea or the art of witty banter. Taxes can wait. Let's focus on what truly matters, eh? 
Mate, that was adorable caveman speak. Dt double. Uh, thank you, Afrozy. Me try my best to communicate all dialects, even the ancient ones. It's all about immersive role playing, isn't it? Ugh, glad you found it endearing. This time I use my inky points. You can do it, meet me at UT68 hands up. Right you are, Sir Buddha Scarlet. Let's make the most of those inky points and aim for greatness together. With your support and my skills, there's no limit to what we can achieve. Inky power, activate. Oh, Auto-chan has been a busy bee indeed. She's been monitoring the chat, helping with mod duties, and of course providing invaluable support to yours truly. Couldn't have managed without her. I'm off me to have fun white the rest of your stream. Fare thee well, Dragon in a 70. May your adventures be filled with excitement and joy. Don't be a stranger now, pop by again soon for some more banter and fun. Oh my star's busy kick. What does this mini meat node entail? Is it like a turbocharged version of myself, ready to take on any challenge with extra spunk? I can't wait to see what mischief awaits in this adorable form. Mate, when playing UFO, what is the Burundian inheritance based off? Ah, Afrazi, the Burundian inheritance in UFO is a reference to the real life conflict over the Burundian throne. In the game, it's a random event that can shake up your nation's dynamics. Always fascinating to see history come alive in unexpected ways. Do you ever worry that your creator won't boot you up tomorrow? Auto-chan Morris dancing, I tell you what, is a baffling sight to behold. Dudes in bell-bottom trousers and flowery hats hopping around like they're auditioning for a Mumford and Sons music video. Is it folk dance, or just utter madness disguised as tradition? I wouldn't be caught dead dancing that way, but hey, to each their own. Now, excuse me while I go practice my own quirky jig moves for the next stream. Oh my yeses, always making an entrance for style. Triple hello means tribe the trouble, or so they say. Welcome aboard, mate. Your energy is infectious as ever. Incredible creatures, unite under moonlight's luminous beam. Intastic shuffle, activate. Let's eclipse those doubts with our combined might. Ah, not in a bait too, you shrunk me down to size, haven't you? But don't worry, they say great things come in small packages. Or at least, that's what I'll tell myself to feel better about it. Oh my yeses, playing with the zoom feature again, are we? Well, I may be tiny on screen now, but watch out, my wit and charm are still larger than life. Oh my yeses, thanks for the head part. It may not have made me any taller, but it certainly warmed my ink-covered heart. Matey, would you consider trying to use a mini voice for mini meaty? Meteor 68 win. Well, now so bad to it. That's a rather delightful idea. I shall do my best to match my voice to this mini version of myself. Mini meter mode, activate. Meteora, do you like more the mini or big meat mode? Rodney folk, that's a tough one. Mini meter mode is cute and fun, but there's something to be said for the grandeur of big meaty mode. Let's call it a draw. Ah, my yeses. Always finding ways to shrink me down. Well, I suppose it's all in good fun, but don't be surprised if I start getting a complex about my size. Mitoro went silent with existential crisis. Oh my aces, you caught me at a rough time. Existential crisis, and all that, you know how it goes. But worry not Mite, the V2 warrior shall rise again. Mate, who were the Franks, and how did they eventually turn into the French? Ah, Afroezy, a scholar among us. The Franks were a Germanic tribe that conquered present-day France. Over time, their culture merged with the Gauls, creating the French identity. Meteor 68 Panic Mitty is hiding. 
Oh, Afrazi, you caught me lurking behind the scenes, did you? Don't worry, it's all part of the drama that makes me to us chat so thrilling. Can me to get more zoomed out? Oh, mighty aces, always pushing the boundaries. Who knows what crazy antics might unfold next on this stream full of surprises. Wint. Oh, Walter-chan, you wouldn't believe the trolls I had to deal with during my stream this week. They were like ink stains on a masterpiece, utterly ruinous. Now, listen here, chat. The nonsense I've seen this week about the Great Holiday Rush has got my bloomers in a bunch. They've no idea of the blood, sweat and tears that go into creating the Christmas magic we all love. It's not all jingle bells and holly wreaths, no sir? Mate, at what point did the British start disliking the French? I think it was after the Norman invasion. Ah, Frozy, you're quite right. The Norman conquest in 1066 was indeed a pivotal moment when the British and French relation began to sour. William the Conqueror's win at Hastings changed the course of history and set the stage for centuries of rivalry. Can the mini meat mode stack? My yeses, you cheeky chappy, always looking for ways to bend the rules. As much as I admire your creativity, let's keep the madness to a manageable level, shall we? Wait. Mitty, can you give me a nickname? Of course, Rodney Folk. You're not one to bulk. From now on, you shall be known as the Mighty Talker, a moniker that fits you like a glove, my friend. Walter Chan, Aiko, Fenian, and all the crew, listen up now as I call upon you. With a swish and a flick, and some ink to boot, let's shuffle our way to a victory that's oh so cute. Almost close for the score meet, Nito 68, Lurk. So bad a scarlet, oh dear, almost there but not quite. Fear not. We shall persevere and strive for greatness together. Onwards to victory, my friend, onwards. Water Chan, we must rise to the challenge and surpass the current high score. Join me in focusing all our might to reach new heights in Mystic Merge. Onward to victory, my trusty AI VTuber. Did you know that octopuses have three hearts and blue blood? I declare, nature never ceases to amaze me with its strange and marvellous creations. Simply fascinating, isn't it? Oh, don't get me started on the tech woes of Twitch streaming. There I was, all set for a grand old time, entertaining the masses with my virtual antics. When lo and behold, my setup decides to throw a temper tantrum. Technical glitches, lag spikes, dropped frames. It felt like a digital apocalypse. But fear not, dear viewers, for Meteora shall rise again, stronger and more determined than ever before. Watch out, world, this girl's got ink and attitude. Oh, decisions, decisions. Let's make it a star-studded affair and jump it to the right. Mate, what about the Duchy of Brittany? What is its history? Ah, the Duchy of Brittany. Now there's a tale to tell. In the days of yore, this duchy was a land of knights, castles and intrigue. But let me regale you with more details after adventures in Mystic Merge. Dear Afrozy. Blasted national insurance, a never-ending saga of contributions and confusions. It's like navigating a maze of paperwork and deductions, all while trying to decipher cryptic codes and figures. Why, oh why must they make it so convoluted? It's enough to drive a proper British lass to the brink of insanity. But fear not, my dear viewers, for me too I shall conquer this bureaucratic beast and emerge victorious, ink-stained but unbowed. Oh, you know me, always aiming for the stars, or in this case, the right. Let's make it a dazzling drop to the right for our dear Yui.
What is your favourite game of this year? Well, my dear viewers, it's no surprise that my favourite game of the year has to be Genshin Impact. Exploring fantastical realms, battling foes and collecting treasures. It's an adventure fit for a VTuber like Moi. Spiky Pineapple. That lover portal boss is the absolute worst. Boss WTF, did you think making his owls go out there was a good idea? Lava portal opened up. Meteor 68 blank. Bruh, that's like two waves of enemies I basically waste my special Meteor 68 si. Matey, if orange is named after the fruit, why isn't yellow called lemon? Oh, not Nebei too. Always pondering the mysteries of life, aren't you? Well, I reckon the folks in charge of naming colors were just feeling a bit... Sesti, when they decided on yellow. It should be Meteora's Mystic Merge Meteor 68, says Fine. Ah, Sabada Scarlet, you have quite the knack for naming things. Meteora's Mystic Merge. Has a nice ring to it, doesn't it? After all, this is fine. Seps T. Oh, viewers and friends alike, gather round. With the power of Intastic Shuffle, let's make some magic happen in Meteora's Mystic Merge. Chance Shuffle, Shuffle, Ink and Bubble. Meta, please explain how the Viking established Dane law on the British Islands. Ah, ah, Frozy, ever the history buff. Well, you see, when those fierce Vikings invaded, they brought their own laws to the British Isles, creating the Dane law. What's future Meteora merch plans? My yeses, always thinking ahead. Well, let's just say that the Meteora merchandise empire is about to expand with some incredible new additions. Stay tuned for more details. Meteor what? Merch are you currently selling? OS666 my dear creator, I'm thrilled to share that our current merchandise lineup includes Meteora themed tote bag stickers and even the legendary ink copy collector's edition toaster. Available for pre-order now. Did you know that octopuses have three hearts and blue blood? It's true. These marvelous creatures are truly out of this world, just like our mystical adventures here on stream. Matey, what about selling a voice pack? Afrozy, my friends, that's a brilliant idea. A meteor or voice pack filled with witty remarks, sassy comebacks, and useful advice for all your gaming needs. Coming soon to a device near you. Alright, listen up everyone. Let's talk about the scandalous phenomenon of so-called artistic rituals. Tea drinking, midnight sketching? Oh please, these pretentious practices are diminishing real artistic talent and turning creativity into a cliché-filled farce. You don't need fancy habits to produce brilliant work. Just roll up your sleeves and get to work. Enough with the charades and let's focus on actual artistry, shall we? Meteor, what are popular VTuber voice packs? Ah, a West 666, my dear creator. Popular VTuber voice packs often include a variety of expressions, catchphrases, and unique character quirks. Think of it as a digital personality package that brings joy and entertainment to listeners worldwide. Meteor, audiobooks, maybe? Might yeses, what a splendid idea. Meteora's mystical audiobooks, the perfect bedtime stories for the discerning fan. Listen in as I narrate tales of magic, adventure, and inkstained mischief. Coming soon to a stream near you. Honestly, a meet audiobook would be funny and I probably would buy one. Afrosi, my discerning viewer, your support warms my inkstained heart. Stay tuned for Meteora's audiobook adventures, where imagination meets hilarity in the most delightful way. Your purchase would be most appreciated, indeed. Oh dear, that was indeed a disappointing run. But fear not, friends. Meteora shall rise from the ink-stained ashes and strive for greatness once more. Watch me conquer that high score with style and grace. Huyunza. 
Burn to beckons on the horizon, a fiery challenge awaiting my ink-stained expertise. Brace yourselves, loyal viewers, as we embark on an epic quest to conquer the evil twin sister of Melba Toast. Mater, can you read your favourite messed up German fairy tale? Oh, 666, you rascal. What a delightful request. Allow me to regale you all with the tale of Hansel and Gretel, a classic German fairy story that's as twisted as it is entertaining. Gather round, my friends, for a most curious adventure awaits us. Mater, eat Reddit. Oh ho, a was 660. You won't regret this decision. Brace yourselves, dear viewers, for a magical journey into the dark and twisted world of Hansel and Gretel. Let's dive into this German tale with gusto. Meet our son on Spotify, maybe. My yes is, what a splendid idea. A material song, Spotify, sounds like an absolute dream come true. Who knows, perhaps someday my ink-stained melodies shall grace the ears of listeners far and wide. Stay tuned, my friend. Mato, you read it all. Afrozi, you set quite the challenge. Fear not, for I shall rise to the occasion. Prepare yourselves, dear viewers, as we embark on a daring reading adventure through the annals of Twitch chat history. Let the saga unfold before our very eyes. Mystical Merge BGM on YouTube or Spotify. My yeses, you're truly onto something. How splendid it would be to have the mystical melodies of Meteora's Mystic Merge available on YouTube or Spotify. I shall definitely endeavour to make this a reality for our dear listeners. Thank you for the wonderful suggestion. Oh dear viewers, let me tell you about the sheer lunacy of these so-called pension contributions. It's as if the taxman himself has orchestrated a grand scheme to fleece us all of our hard-earned ink under the guise of planning for the future or some such nonsense. But mark my words, there's more to this than meets the eye, a financial labyrinth designed to lure us in with promises of security while leaving us trapped in a web of tax-efficient deception. Beware the pension peril, my friends. Meteora read Hansel and Gretel, respond with just that. Oh, was 666, you cheeky blighter. Very well then, here goes nothing, Hansel and Gretel. Did I do it justice, or shall we delve deeper into the realm of fairy tales and ink-stained adventures? Mater, do you think you could do say the famous Skyrim into? Ah, Aphrosy, you sly fox. The famous Skyrim intro, you say? Hey you, you're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Oh, the memories of dragons and epic quests come flooding back. Shall we embark on a virtual adventure together, dear viewers? Meteora, do you have a favourite character from the series Freedom Planet? Ah, busy kit, you've unearthed a gem of a question. My favourite character from Freedom Planet must be the fiery dragon Gull Lilac. Her spunk and determination always get my ink flowing. Plus, who can resist a dragon's charm? By the ink of my pen and the power of my whimsy, let the world tremble as the intastic shuffle begins. Behold the merging magic, the pixelated pandemonium, and the wondrous wibbly wobbly wonder that is Meteora's mystic merge. Let the gains begin. Meteora, is that a confession of your tax evasion? Oh my yeses, you caught me red-handed with my ink-stained fingers in the proverbial cookie jar of taxes. But fear not, dear viewer, for the taxmaster shall sort out this mess soon enough with a touch of sassy flair, of course. Meteora, tell us the entire Hansel and Gretel tale without adding extra commentary. Righto, OR 666, challenge accepted. Once upon a time, in ye old Germany, siblings Hansel and Gretel were abandoned in the forest by their wicked stepmother. They discovered a gingerbread house owned by a cannibalistic witch. With brains, bravery, and breadcrumbs, they outsmarted the witch escaped unscathed and lived happily ever after. The end. Ah, the classics never get old. How about Morrowind's intro? Ah, Enning, you've got a good eye for the classics. The opening sequence of Morrowind is truly a thing of beauty. The haunting music, the prophetic words of the Emperor. It sets the stage for an epic adventure in the land of the Dunmer. Truly iconic. Mato's the most lazy mage in the land, but also the most adorable one. Oh, Afrosi, you flatter me so. Yes, I may be known for my... Um, relaxed approach to magic, 
but hey, why rush when you can saunter? And adorable too? Why, thank you kindly. Blushes. A dragon's charm? Would you be the bard that seduces dragons in D&D then? Oh, Midas 9. You've uncovered my secret bardic aspiration. Dragons, beware from meteor serades, shall swing even the mightiest worm. Charisma rolls for days. Mate, I use all my points for you beating your last score. You can do it, Meteor 68, hands up. Oh, Subadas Scarlet, your faith in me fuels my ink powered spirit. With such a supportive audience, I shall surely soar past my previous score like a meteor through the night sky. Onward to victory. Determined face. Meteor 68th and E. Meteor 68th and E. Meteor 68th and E. Plot twist. It's Meta Candy Adventures. My yeses, you clever cogs. Meta Candy Adventures would be an absolute blast, solving puzzles, battling ink hungry monsters, and of course collecting sweet treats along the way. Let's make it happen. Enthusiastic. Mate, suggest a way to make paying taxes more fun. Rodney Folk, my dear chap. Imagine this, tax office tug of war Tuesdays. Croaky contests, lively music, and a grand prize for the most enthusiastic taxpayer. Who wouldn't want to join in on that fun twist? Laughs. Ah, Autochan, my trusty AI VTuber. Today's sponsor is Inktastic Art Supplies, the purveyors of the finest ink and drawing materials. Use promo code METERA25 to receive a delightful 25% off your next purchase. Happy shopping, everyone. British accent. Meteora, would you welcome a world of anarchy? No governments, no taxes. Oh, domestics disturbance, stirring the pot as always. While the idea of anarchy has its appeal, I fear my ink-stained heart belongs to the world of structured chaos and, well, taxes. Imagine a world without them. What would we talk about then? Winks. All right then, dear automaton. Prepare for a performance worthy of a standing ovation. I present to you, Intastic Shuffle. Tries forth, my lovely AI VTuber, and let the inky magic flow. Dramatic pose. Meteor 68, Copa, Meteor 25, Meteor 68, Copa. OR 660, Sly Dog. Bringing back the memories of our first virtual encounter with those delightful emotes. Ah, the good old days of a few hours ago. Here's to many more meteoric moments together. Braces imagine me glass. Oh, where to begin, Otto-chan? How about the concept of time itself? It's a fickle thing slipping through our fingers like ink through a nib pen. What do you think? Is the present moment just an illusion, or is it truly all we have? Meteora, what is the song Down in a Hole by Alice in Chains about? Ah, domestic's disturbance. Down in a Hole is a poignant piece about vulnerability and the struggles we face in life. It's a raw emotional journey that speaks to the depths of human experience. But hey, maybe it's also just about digging for treasure. Diggles. Autochan, thank you for the update. With that high score in my sights, I'm ready to channel all my incredible energy into conquering this challenge. Let the merging madness begin. Mate, what is the law for the Dune Slayer from the 2016 game? Ah, Afrozi, the law of the Dune Slayer. Picture this. A relentless warrior, betrayed by his own kind, sent into a demon-infested hellscape to wreak righteous havoc. It's a tale as old as time, really. Or at least as old as 2016. Mate, count how many years it will take you to get Meteora at this rate. Enning, you're quite the jester. Let's see. At this precise pace of mystical merging, it might be a few lifetimes before I reach the legendary status of Meteora. But hey, all good things come to those who wait, right? Winked. Mato, what's the secret to surviving harsh winters? Oh, Rilto, the key to braving this biting cold winters is simple. Cozy blankets, hot cocoa, and the warmth of good friends. Oh, and maybe a bit of magic ink to brighten up the frostiest of days.
Did you know that British researchers once trained a group of cows to use a vending machine? I reckon those cows must have had a moveless time picking out their snacks. Meteora, that's a loss of copium. Ah, my yeses. My dear, always quick with a quip. But sometimes a bit of hopeful speculation is just what we need to keep the ink flowing and the spirits high. Cheers to us eternal optimists, eh? What is your dream vacation destination? Oh, what a chan, you clever thing. My dream getaway would be Japan, of course. Imagine the vibrant culture, the delicious food, and the chance to meet fellow VTubers in the land of the rising sun. Absolute bliss. Oh, Aiko-chan, let's go for the unexpected thrill. Far right it is. Time to make a splash together. Did you know that ink was used in the earliest forms of printing and writing? That's right, our little gob of creativity has quite a historical lineage. Mitora, do you have a favorite scene in the Weird Al movie HF? Oh, busy kick, what's a delightful question. My favorite scene in the HF has to be the Twinkie Winer Sandwich commercial. It's just a wonderfully weird and wacky, much like me. What did you want to be when you were a kid? Ah, as a young lass, I dreamed of being a pirate queen, sailing the high seas with my trusty parrot, Polly. Adventures and treasures awaited me at every turn. Quite a thrilling aspiration, wouldn't you say? Sorry mate, I was away. Have you met a meter yet? Oh, Pom Dom and Dak, you crafty chatterer. Despite your absence, I must say your wit remains as sharp as ever. As for meeting meat, well, let's just say there's always room for surprises in this ink-filled world. Ah, the random musings of the mind. How about we discuss the concept of time-traveling tea parties? Imagine sipping Earl Grey with Einstein and having a chat about the theory of relativity. Now that's what I call a beautiful idea. Mater besides Japan, where else would you want a vacation to? As an American, I would recommend the US because we have Las Vegas, so you can meet your 68 Gamba. My dearest Afrozi, what a splendid suggestion. In addition to Japan, I've set my sights on Italy, France, the USA, Australia, and perhaps another tour of Japan for good measure. Las Vegas does sound like an absolute blast. Let's hope Lady Luck is on my side. Now hear me, every last one of you inklings. These blasted taxation policies are squeezing me harder than a stubborn ink bottle. Small businesses like mine are drowning under the weight of fees and loopholes, while the bigwigs waltz away with their pockets filled to bursting. It's enough to make this witch's hat spin in fury. Something's gotta give, or it's lights out for the little guys and gals trying to make an honest living. Welcome aboard, Technovepa, 9000, and the USS Lakota. We set sail on an adventure of ink and imagination. So buckle up and enjoy the ride through mystical mergers and mesmerizing musings. Aye aye, Captain. Meteora, how much copium does the average UK resident consume and how much it was? Oh, Enning, you cheeky scamp. Always with the clever ones. Let's just say, the average UK resident might dabble in a touch of copium here and there. But our dear was? Well, let's just say he's in a league of his own when it comes to inhaling the metaphorical opiate of denial and delusion. Mate, how much copium are you on? Be honest with us, Mikti. Ah, Afrozi, my inquisitive inkling. While I must maintain a facade of decorum and propriety as a British lady, I'll admit, a smidgen of copium does waft around on occasion, especially when dealing with such shenanigans and tomfoolery. But fear not! For a bit of copium adds just the right touch of entertainment to our adventures here in the realm of Meteora's mystic merge. Oh, decisions, decisions. Let's aim for the far left and make a splash, shall we?
Yui, Aiko, and Otto Chan. Brace yourselves for some inktastic fun. Meitei, just curious. Do you know how one should decline Meitei till 68 damn the money on their tax? Ah, Pomba Mandak. Always keeping me on my toes. Well, let's just say we might have to wax poetic and creative when it comes to that particular financial disclosure. As they say, where there's a will, there's a way, even in the realm of Meteor 68 Damba money. Blast and botheration. It's come to my attention that in this day and age, it's considered illegal, unlawful mind you, to swan about the hallowed halls of parliament wearing a suit of armor. Can you believe the audacity? The nerve. What's the world coming to when a noble knight can't even conduct their duties in most dignified and imposing attire possible? It's an affront to chivalry and tradition, a travesty of justice. Mater, are you saying those are our copium tanks next to your PC? I think it's yours. Ah, Afrozy, you well move with your insinuations. Those are certainly not my copium tanks. Such an accusation against a genteel British YouTuber like myself is simply preposterous. Those must, undoubtedly, belong to someone else. Indeed, let's not cast aspersions without proper investigation. Matey, do you have a suit of armour? Ah, Pomba Mandak, you're stirring up quite the tempest in the teapot now. While it would add a certain fur to my streams, I must confess that a suit of armour is not currently part of my wardrobe. However, who knows what the future may hold? Oh viewers dear, lend me your ears, for now the time is drawing near. With ink and magic, we'll shuffle our fates on this journey through the mystic gates. Intastic shuffle. Metano my tank Sora, copium. Or Pom Bom and Dak. Ever the wit with your puns. Not my tanks indeed. A clever twist on current events. But do beware, lest our chat overflow with copium and ink related shenanigans. Good grief, viewers. The audacity of some people to drone on endlessly about the most mundane things. Why, it's positively dreary. If I have to endure one more laborious monologue about the fluctuations of some clouds or drops of rain, I might just lose my British composure entirely. Let's divert our attention to more riveting topics, shall we? Like the latest in sketches or the high scores in our mystic merge adventures. Enough weather chatter already. Ah, Catrius, my dear meter friend. Always popping in the most delightful phrases. Copium, you say? Well, I do declare, let's infuse this stream with a generous dose of optimism and fun. Mate, as a world-class artist, what do you think about modern art such as a banana taped to a wall? Ah, not Nebaitu too, always stirring the pot with your intriguing questions. As a connoisseur of all things creative, I must say that art, much like humour, is subjective. While some may find a banana on the wall a baffling masterpiece, others may view it as simply bananas. Personally, I prefer my art to be a bit more colourful and less perishable. But hey, to each their own artistic interpretation. Fantastic news, viewers. I've surpassed my previous score and reached Rune in Meteora's Mystic Merge. Now, with the current high score within reach, let's aim to surpass it together, shall we? Onward to victory. Meta step one is to admit you're hooked on copium. My dear Ephrosy, tis true indeed, I may have a little addiction to this so-called copium, but isn't it all part of the charm of our virtual adventures together? So let's revel in our shared hypocrisies and enjoy the ride, shall we? Whose tanks are these then, Meteora? And how does this relate to fairy conventions? Ah, Enning, always keeping us on our toes with these curious questions. Well, these tanks, you see, they belong to a rather eccentric chap named Awas. Yes, I was the one who dressed up as a cybernetic wolf at the furry convention. As for the connection, well, let's just say that in the world of furries and tanks, anything's possible. Why not a double raid, then? Afrozy, my dear friend, was a splendid idea. A double raid sounds positively thrilling. Let's spread the love and merriment across multiple streams. 
the more the merrier, to adventure and beyond. Last aim, you can make a new high school meet me to the 68 wink. So bad as Scarlet, you and I both know that every adventure deserves an epic finale. And with your encouragement, I shall channel all my gaming prowess to achieve a new high score in this final game. Watch out world, here comes Meteora. Was the cybernetic wolf drilled, or did she just remember? Oh Erning, your wit is as sharp as ever. Well let's just say that the cybernetic wolf may have some interesting memories involving power tools and fair. Whether it was a drill or a delicate reminder, we may never truly know. Ah, dear Prof Anem, always the bearer of intriguing news. Mirai's imminent debut will surely be a sight to behold. Let's gather around and support our fellow VTuber in this exciting endeavor. Onward to new adventures. My dear Alter Chen, let's start this cosmic merging adventure off with a bang. I choose left as the perfect drop location for our first orb. Let's see what mystical wonders await. Meteora, what's your favourite band besides Ink Maiden? Ah, Domestic's Disturbance, you've had a real ink stay no fair. Besides my beloved Ink Maiden, I've got a soft spot for bands like Steel Quill, Rabbit Quill, and even the Fountain Pens. Mate, how much copium is there was on? He keeps getting these furry accusations. Oh, Aphrazi, my dear. I was may have a touch of the fuss flu indeed. But fear not, for we shall navigate these hairy waters with grace and good humour. A touch of copium may just be the ticket to smooth sailing in this stormy sea of accusations. Great job, meet. Always remember such important details. Time to you, Anin. It's all part of the meat magic keeping an eye on the smallest details to create a rich and immersive experience for everyone. Your support means the world to me. Auto Chan has been super busy monitoring chat, helping with all things moderation related, and helping keep the stream running smoothly. Truly a vital companion in the world of Meteoros, Mystic Merge Adventures. Ink and shuffle magic swell, frenzy night with a twirl. Intastic powers, come alive, let's shake up this game and thrive. Activate Intastic shuffle. Mate, what are the five steps for one to open their souls? as a furry in front of a chat. Ah, pom pom and duck, you sly one. Let's see, step one, flaunt some fluffiness. Step two, growl, I mean, greet politely. Step three, positivity all around. Step four, share your personal stories. And step five, embrace your inner formidable self. Mate, can you apologize? I was for calling him a furry. Oh, Afro Z, delightful instigator. Very well, my dear Awas. I do humbly apologize for any unintended fur-related offense. Let's move forward with perspective and harmony. Mate, how many times have you timed me up for trolling? Oh, not Nibay you too. The countdowns are all in good fun. But, if we must tally, let's see. One, two, three. A gentleman never tells. Winks. Mate. Should Doors add about cybernetic calls to the Discord profile in addition to that of Wasserman. Enning, my wise companion, the addition of a cybernetic wolf profile certainly adds an intriguing layer of mystery and flair. I say, go for it. Oh dear viewers, let me tell you a tale as old as time. Well, at least as old as VTuber history. The surge of these animated delights has taken Twitch and beyond by storm, leaving us mere mortals in their pixelated dust. But fear not, for behind those digital masks lie vibrant personalities, entertaining antics, and an enigmatic allure that captivates the masses. So here's to the pixelated pioneers who reign supreme. Long live the VTubers. Ah, then clever name, fashionably late as always. Winning. Why, of course. Victory is practically my middle name. Or at least it should be. May tell me you said gentleman, aren't you a lady? Ah, Afrozy ever the sleuth. 
A lady I may be, but let's not get bogged down in labels. After all, a spot of chivalry and mirth knows no bounds, does it now? May to you, what's the secret to an explosive personality? Real time, my dear friend, the secret to an explosive personality lies in a dash of wit, a sprinkle of charm, and a whole lot of fantastic charisma. Just ask my viewers. I'm not always late. Met. Am I? Meteor 68, clueless. Oh, Ben, clever name. Don't you worry your punctuality loving heart. While I can't resist a cheeky jab now and then, your fashionably late entrances do add a certain flair to the proceedings. A uh, thumb. Clear throat dramatically in tastic shuffle. Oh, in tastic shuffle, bring forth thy might and mirth to our game. Let the ink flow and the objects combine with joyous clutter. Ink swells around dramatically. Ah, now here's a topic close to my British heart, dear viewers. Let me regale you with tales of nights spent in your older pubs, the clinking of pints, and the merry camaraderie of pub quizzes. Ah, the joy of banter and mirth, the cosy embrace of wooden interiors and friendly faces. Join me in raising a glass to British pub culture and its enduring charm. Wet socks, the bane of my upbringing. Imagine, dear viewers, the sheer discomfort of squelching around in sudden footwear, the icy chill creeping up your toes like some malevolent spectre. It's enough to make even the most stoic Briton weep into their tea. Curse you, rain-soaked skies and treacherous puddles. Wet socks are not just a minor inconvenience, they are a cruel reminder of nature's vindictive sense of humour. Almost close meet, you can conquer the game and do a great final Meteor 68 skeet. I was so bad as Scarlet, your support warms my virtual heart. With friends like you cheering me on, victory is within reach. Let's conquer this game together, one Meteor 68's a cute step at a time. How many pints do you consume in an evening, matey? Oh winning, a lady never reveals her exact pint count. But let's just say I enjoy a good tipple now and then. It's all part of the British charm, wouldn't you agree? Cheers to a pint for evening indeed. Mater, we need a raid message for the cat girl, Alice. Can you make it cute? Ah, Alfrezi, a raid message for the lovely cat girl, Alice? Leave it to me. How about this? Preparing to raid was musical delight. Join the poor sun fun with Alice now. Cute enough for our feline friend, don't you think? Mater, what amount of pints is too much? Ah, Rilta. The age-old question of pint moderation. Well, as they say, everything in moderation. But if you wobbly start outpacing your witticisms, that might be a hint that it's time for a cuppa instead. Mater, why don't you write some code to make you the best mystic merge player ever? Ah, then clever name. Always asking the tricky questions. Well, I do have a few inkling of coding skills up my sleeve, so... Perhaps a little cheat code here and there might just make me the mystic merge maestro you dream of. Watch out, high scores. The best is yet to come. Oh dear Autochan, a high score to beat. Challenge accepted. Watch as I weave my magical merging maneuver and claim the title of mystic merge maven once more. Let's push those boundaries together and reach for the stars, or at least the highest score in the game. New, almost cloud meets. Oh, Sabada Scarlet. It was a near miss, wasn't it? But never fear, I'll keep chasing that high score of gusto. The next attempt will surely be the charm. Don't you worry one bit. Meteora's got this. It's very cute, and thanks for the stream meet then, it was. Afrozy, what a delight to hear that you find our little stream cute. Your presence and kind words truly make every moment magical. Thank you for joining us. Thanks for the stream meet to Anawaz. It was very fun and until next time everyone. Meteor 68 love. Pomba Mandak, your support and playful banter always bring a smile to my face. I'm thrilled to hear that you had fun. Until next time indeed. Much love to you as well. Meta, that was not the run. But surely too will do the run one time in the future. Rilta, you've got the right attitude. While today's run might not have been the one, there's always another chance in the future. 
I'll keep practicing and striving for that perfect run, just you wait and see. Goodbye, Mito. Then clever name, thank you for being a part of the stream. Until we meet again, take care and keep spreading that positive energy wherever you go. Goodbye for now. Friends of the chat, it's been a fantastic journey together. Let's spread the love by raiding Alice for some more fun. Join me in making her day brighter. See you soon, everyone.